happened last time? That's a great question. <laughs> now that's a question. Only there was a way to know. Previously on Die of Laughter. While the group debated going to the stables for JB's donkey or directly to the druids Declan the Alchemist had told them of for a cure, a ringing sound began to, began to grow in JB's ears as the spores most likely did the same beneath his skin. Deciding the donkey wouldn't slow them down any more than their debate, Pob took the lead and headed off towards the stables, where the party was introduced to the owners, a pair of half-breed mountain man gnomes named Nanik and Lek. Inside, JB traded his hat, which he claimed was an original Stetso, for the price of Wonderboy's stay as well as an additional ten gold. It was while retrieving Wonderboy that JB noticed the other three horse men sleeping in a stall adjacent to his ass ass. Outside, Richter Kane, or rather his body, sat in the mud, tethered to a rope, doing a whole lot of nothing. When JB returned to the group, they argued over dropping off the unconscious body of the black horse man, Rob, causing tensions to tighten even further amongst the party members. Pob then flicked a cigarette into Hugh's fumbling lips to keep him quiet for a moment before walking inside where he bonded with Nanique over the pain of working with idiots. Pob then proceeded to drop off Rob while he talked to Bob, or rather was talked over by Bob, but managed to learn in the process a tiny bit more about the story of Richter and Hanker Kane. This knowledge was stifled, however, by the fact that the crimes were, as Bob repeated himself, unspeakable. In exchange for Rob, Pob was given 15 gold by Bob, and in his kindness, Pob tempted to split his earnings with JB and Hugh if they were willing to divulge how much gold they truly had. However, this act was thwarted by Hugh, or perhaps Chester's, greed. Pob then mentioned he had other, definitely not killed in a tragic landslide, friends that he could go hang with, but the party stuck together, moving north after checking in briefly with Baby Duke. Hugh also attempted to ventilate the Chester suit from his face, but found that he couldn't, which seemed concerning, but due to his disagreeable nature, nobody really paid any mind. Exiting Pinewood Pass to the north, Pob was able to find and identify a patch of sweet-smelling blue and silver striped focus mushrooms and fed some to himself and Baby Duke. Pob then noticed the mushrooms formed a trail, recalling that they often led to a larger mushroom approximately the size of a house, which could be where the druids were located. Bob also noticed there was a curious split between the blue and silver mushrooms and a patch of the thickening and more sickening orange and silver mushrooms. But after further investigation and arguing amongst the party, Bob decided to lead on into the blue yonder. A loud cloudburst interrupted further discussion, and again, Bob recognized this as the work of something unnatural and decided it was most likely being caused by the druids they sought. During this time, Hugh finally took the liberty to divulge the information he knew about the zygome mushrooms, letting the others know they were a parasitic fungus that could eventually control their host. Hugh lost focus, but Pob successfully was able to steer them steadily to a large blue mushroom at the center of a ring of the blue and silver focus mushrooms. It was here indeed they found the home of a druid who introduced herself as Nell Swellelf. At her campfire, they were offered a round of beer. As Nell told them of the Zygome invasion and rumors that it might be stopped by the Great Druid of Mount Elty, of how her husband, Breen, had gone in search of the Great Druid with two others, the two she now tended to, but never returned, and how it must be linked to the recent earthquakes and how this Great Druid, a character thought to be more of a myth than a man until recently, must be able to cure JB and put a stop to this. Noticing in the nick of time that Nell's companions had turned to mushroom men in her triage and were preparing to throw a large lump of fungus-coated earth at her, Hugh shoved Nell while Pob flared his duster and delivered a flourishing spin kick to her chest, sending her flying into the projectile where it burst on her back before knocking her unconscious on the forest floor. JB then dismounted Wonderboy and dashed behind a well on the far side of camp, readying his bow, waiting the perfect moment to attack. Seeing her vulnerable, the mushroom-coated men charged towards Nell's unconscious body, as one began beating her with its staff while the other took a swing at Pob. Pob, however, proved to be too quick, Matrix dodging out of the way before replying with a sharp slash of his harpoon. Meanwhile, Hugh began hurling vials of acid, missing the mushroom men but forming deadly pools on the ground in the process. Pob told a joke, inflicting hideous laughter on the one nearest to Hugh, then yelled, This is for Nell Swell Elf, before Bane cracking its spine and hurling it into the nearby acid, sizzling upon the earth. As the mushroom man sputtered to death, laughing in the acid, JB began firing arrows at the other, eventually shooting it in the crotch, causing it to charge him. Hugh seized this moment to pat the unconscious Nell down, finding five good berries in her pocket, as well as a scroll that was he was unable to decipher. 
placing the scroll back on her person, he then slowly woke Nell and did a half-hearted job of raising her to her feet, feeding her some of her own stolen good berries while explaining in one breath, as best as he could, the gist of the situation. Noticing that the mushroom-covered man JB had cross-shot was now charging towards the well, Bob wasted no time, front-flipping off a nearby table before intercepting the fungus-infested druid with a triumphant toss of his chained harpoon, gripping it by the back so that it could advance no further. Moving in for the killing blow, his own health be damned, JB left off the well, arrow in hand, stabbing the remaining mushroom-covered man's face, killing it as another cloud of spores burst into the air. Pob then pulled the chain back, snapping the spine of the creature, with arrows protruding now from its face and groin, making sure its death was final. Combat ended and the party was able to question Nell, who between coughs claimed she certainly wasn't sick and that she would stay waiting for Breen, before giving Pob a sheet of music, the one that Hugh had rifled through, telling him it was a piece known as the Lord of the Storm that playing it would destroy the scroll, but allow him to summon a terrific storm, and that a perfect performance would bring about the Lord of the Storm himself, as well as informing him that should he be successful in getting the spores from the Great Druid, she could teach him how to play it as often as he liked. Nell again pleaded that the party go to Mount Elty and find the Great Druid for healing spores, and that should they find Breen or signs of what happened to him, to please, to please bring him back as well along with the spores. JB, who had now inhaled a second breath of spores, was told by Nell that he probably had three more dark suns before he would turn as her companions had, and that the base of Mount Elty would be at least half a day's travel away. In addition, Nell let JB know that consuming yeast would buy him more time, and she began to help him attach a keg to his ass-ass. Hugh then asked if Nell could save Chip and Chunk from their seemingly endless slumber, and she said it was indeed within her powers, so the party left them in her care so that she might bring their minds back to their bodies. Pob also inquired if she could help the horsemen, should they ever arrive, informing her that Rob's condition was the same as Chip and Chunk, and that the horsemen seemed like pretty decent dudes. Hugh then began arguing to leave Richter Kane chained up behind with Nell, before Pob and JB dismissed him and began heading off into the woods towards Mount Elty. I, I have to plug in my fucking uh, dice cam real quick. Just give Go me like it. two seconds. I'm it. sorry. Nah, I gotta I gotta read more junk anyways. I need to buy some oh, fucking fuck. tool for a dice game. You see it's called Mount Heldy. LT or LD. LT. 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 Okay. I'm trying to keep my notes up. This guy. <clears throat> Player after my you own spell heart. E L T Y. Oh, okay, I heard you said that. <laughs> oh, the spelling ah. was the you spelling it. Um, I pronouncing it. <laughs> just very slowly yeah. dissecting. Yeah. It's, it's actually spelled almost exactly the same as his pronunciation. <laughs> hey, if you say LT really quack, quack, quick, it like, nice. it. Quack. We are all firing on all <laughs> cylinders, I can see. <laughs> uh, I haven't spoken out loud in days. I'm shopping on Amazon. <laughs> For what? what? Yeah, you, you've piqued my interest. All right, I'll show it to you, Visible. What? what? I'll show it to why, you. Why is it so exclusive? It's probably some D and D's shopping for trinkets. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's. The, <laughs> I, don't, I didn't know if it would be D and D related. I thought you were just. Uh, I didn't think so until he said just for you. I thought he was probably just shopping for, for diapers and shit. Yeah, I'm with I mean, that. I'm with that. Diapers. He's also the only person that gets to see <clears> this. <throat> well, my fucking recommended is fucked. For Amazon? Yeah. Yeah, it's not, uh... It's not good. <laughs> my, my YouTube is never good on recommended either. <clears throat> I feel like I'll watch I one like video Twitter. in like you watch one video for one thing and then it thinks that's all you want. If I'm ever like fringe interested in something, I right click and pull it up in uh incognito. <laughs> Smart. It doesn't so it doesn't affect my algorithm. Yeah. All right, I'm ready, Freddy. 
Or if it's like hot babe goes to beach, I'm like, well, I'm curious, but I don't want my feed to be all hot well, babes Well, because if you do beach. one, it will do it forever, yeah. and it yep. doesn't matter what it is. All I get now is... I'm not is, a pervert, I'm just interested. I just wanted to listen to some JRPG music, and now the only thing it'll recommend yeah. is JRPG music. It's a little frustrating, but... <clears throat> <clears throat> Proceeding onwards into the woodline, the dark sun is fully risen in the sky, and even amongst the light of the three moons, you have trouble finding your way through the forest. <sighs> the mushrooms have thinned out, and the woodline is thickened, and it's slow going to get JB and his ass, along with the stumbling body of Richter Kane, through without being tangled up. You've been following the most obvious path you can discern, but with all the breaks in it, you're never quite certain if you're on the same trail or not. Strange ruts and footprints intersect and pause without warning, throwing you on and off various trails as you attempt to navigate smoothly. Uh, give me some rolls. What? Already? Oh, yeah. uh, this feels like the Idaho trip. <laughs> Lost the trail ridiculous. and we're... <laughs> yeah. There should absolutely be no comparison between this. Oh, wait, what uh, the fuck? Fuck me, dude. Reroll. I got a nine. Yeah, this is a work of fiction. And Redo. Any resemblance to anything is not because it's lifted from it. Nine. Know, somebody's okay. Got mushrooms. Oh, my God. Wait, I can't find my D20. So this auto center, like, oh! fucking do your job, dude. Wait. Here you go. God, this dice sucks. <laughs> you can you can okay. do an investigation it, or it's a wait. Yeah, Bro, he just made it. It was like nine. He put it a sixteen. No, no, no it was, I just it was a fourteen. God, why do you always accuse me of God? <laughs> you're the one with this a is dice helping hand, us. You, you Brian shouldn't have said yeah. shit. There was, perception, perception, uh, no, or investigation. It, 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 there was, was live footage okay. of you finagling with it. It's like yes, <laughs> you, you you don't pay attention to the beginning part where I finagled it originally. Oh. You have to go back okay, to the first so finagling. That's yeah. That's the sixteen. Dude, this fucking. Oh, well, it's wow. because yeah. I I can't tell on this fucking shit dice whether that's a fourteen or a nineteen. You had to get that's one that's like black. Like, yeah. like look at it, it's all thing. weird. When, so I picked it up and then it was a fucking. I got a nine. I got a nine. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Prove it, dude. Where's your dice cam? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I only got a six. <laughs> Q and JB. Uh, the frequent bout, bouts of Nell's reign over the past few days have been making things more difficult than usual to decipher, even for a keen set of eyes. Yet after a few more hours, despite its best efforts to obscure your travel, you manage to find a bit of a heavier worn route through the woods. It appears to be the trail of a wagon, and based on the footprints you identify, there was one draw animal, most likely a girdle, as well as two sets of footprints that could have been the druids before they were introduced to their mushroomy doom, but see no sign of what could have infected them. The forest here seems relatively peaceful compared to the zygome-filled areas of before, and yet you know based on what you see through the canopy that you still must be approaching Mount Elty. You start to second-guess yourself, but given the density of the surrounding woods, you conclude there aren't too many options for where a wagon could have passed through, and it isn't long before you spy the body of a wood wagon frame. Wait, so did my roll do anything earlier? Yeah. No? yeah, yeah. It was the okay. one that carried us through. Oh, if it wasn't for you, we would have okay. just ended up in a ditch somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and yeah. even as you, as you approach here, you definitely smell tuna. Or something tuna y. Uh, it's kind of been leading like you here pussy. because it's an odd thing yeah. to yeah. smell in the woods. Uh, you don't even notice, JB. Right. <laughs> this is pussy. It's going to make my teeth stink. Okay. Uh, I say, oh, Jerry, go check that out. <laughs> Jerry. What? I don't know Jerry, what you're talking about. No I don't what? notice anything. Yeah. What are we talking about? Yeah, what you the don't, hell are you talking I know you don't about? Notice. There's nothing Ooh. here. <laughs> a I voice in the sky. Wolf, and I play. Look, I mean, you right. noticed it too here. You were able to follow the trail. Oh, All right. yeah, it's right this you, way. Let's, and then I just yeah. walked that way towards it. <laughs> yeah. Sexily, though. Yeah, Long sexy. struts. you kind of Sasha. Yeah. No, I'm doing like basically lunges okay. the whole way there. Oh. Uh, I don't think you could bend your knee. <laughs> yeah. I, <laughs> you do the fundamental part of a lunge in that outfit. Your eyes trace the tipped canopy towards the back, where the lighter wood of the wagon body stands out against the dark wood of the surrounding trees. There's enough light from the three moons for you to see it clearly, and you find yourself admiring and embossing in the wood across the rear opening. 
The Breen Machine, it says in swirling script. Ah. Something of a mix of wood elf font style, yet written in the word of man. Following the edge of the wagon, you're able to see under the ripped covering and inside lock eyes with a narrow pair of someone else's. Ah. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> they appear startled, <laughs> opening wide to meet your gaze as you stare back into the tipped and torn wagon. Through shreds of moonlight, you're able to perceive the hunched over figure of a strange human dressed as a druid. They appear to be crouched over various jars of something pungent and fishy. Mm. Who, who goes there? A tone deaf voice scratches outward. Reveal yourself to me, for I already know who you are. <clears throat> I I run and slide into his view. Like, <laughs> yeah. We come in peace. Yeah. <laughs> uh, like risky business style, like slide into whatever mm. view he he can have of me. I mean, he's triple hanging out the, knife right into the flat yeah, the wagon. He's in the back of kind of messed up. Give me a roll if you want to do that. <laughs> yes, that's, <laughs> I want to slide into view. Knees not bent or anything. I'll let, I'll let Sam do his sliding, his risky business sliding. Okay. Three. <laughs> Dude, I feel like you get one inch and then you go yeah, face first the dirt. It, you try to slide and all you're doing is catching branches on the way and yeah, you just kind of mess up your PVC suit, lose balance, fall Can he forward. Fall? Oh fuck! Can he, is he shit his pants? Yeah. Let me check his. He's on the cusp. He smell where he's his on butt the is. Cusp. By the way, not to be a DOL historian or anything, but I remember JB shit his pants like on episode three and never Haven't cleaned changed. them. <laughs> uh, He's still just st stewing in it. Dude, I'm sure the sun oh, baked I, it all. I think we're probably all nose nose blind to it <laughs> yeah. at this point. Yeah. The shit's he went through the whole <laughs> dream sequence <laughs> thing with his shit pants. Human litter box <laughs> in the living room. Had a bad um, trip. Anyways, yeah, I, I guess I get up and I walk up to the door thing. I go, hey, what's up? Or, you mean Druid? <laughs> yeah, the, uh, where the Druid guy is at the oh. end of his wagon. <laughs> my name uh, is Breen Swell Else. Uh, oh what are God. you doing here? That was quick. Um, we're here to find a cure for my AIDS. Oh, yeah. We're, no, <laughs> we're here for JB. We, we, yeah, we know his hmm. wife. Oh, do we? We do sober. know your wife. Yes. And you know what? We know Nell Swell Elf. Yeah. And, oh, uh, like the lady you God, have you been infected too? <laughs> what the hell? No, 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 no. We're cool. You might think what that. about this him? Probably kicked her right in the face. Uh, oh, wait, no, yeah, JB, JB is yeah, JB is a hundred percent infected. I'm, I'm sick. Yeah. There's some orange. You look like a Last kind of, of Us zombie. I'm sick. Yeah, there's some I'm orange man. spores coming out Ew. of your skin at this point. <laughs> Ew, God, <laughs> gross. I, I don't honestly want to be around. Like wait, so he, he's got like Cheeto dust? It does like, smell bad. Uh, I am I contagious? Spores. I. You will be in a matter of time. Oh. Uh, what's on your wrist? Should we kill him? What's that? What's that on your wrist? My sundial. Yeah. Oh, is that what that is? <laughs> yeah, that's it's awesome. A, yes. Uh, how much for that? The druid circle I thought you gets were like one. a scientist. I, I am a like druid. A, a tinkerer. Yeah, what time not is you. it right now? You. Oh, sundial. no. I, I, it's not it's you. Time, you. What it's <laughs> <laughs> me. Let's get a rush hour <laughs> misunderstanding going. No, I, I'm a guy. I'm a man of science, but I just haven't learned any of it yet. Never seen a sundial. Okay. No. What even wear well, it? I've night, seen though. a sundial, but they're usually affixed to the floor. We don't take them mobily. Yeah. Well, you, well, then you're small-minded. Yeah. Uh, do they? <laughs> I clocked what that was immediately. <laughs> Yo, I wink at the camera. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> unretard for a second. Would a sundial out. work if it's on your wrist? <laughs> if you, like, would that work? I, I think it think has so. to be put in a very specific place. Yeah. I mean, maybe be like stood well, in a weird spot. Yeah, it maybe fine. it's crazy. It works great. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. It's pretty dark out right now. <laughs> like Honestly, I'd be willing like to give it to you right. if you can help me. Help you with what, buddy? I, I have myself to stop the taking... druid of the deep, or the excuse me, <laughs> the great druid. What? I have to stop the great druid. I'm 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 a druid of the deep. Oh, well, the great druid is the one that has the potential f to cure I, what ails us. That's what they want you to think. Well, who? The great druid. The great druid's putting out that information? Listen, I I always thought I was doing the right thing and preparing for life. 
I was first in my like class. Like a twit longer. <laughs> and a human, no okay. less. I joined the inner circle at the Sea of Green and became a druid of the deep. I we won many medals for my distinguished okay, service. <laughs> Self-glorification is not going to get you anywhere with that. I'm a covert yeah. agent now. <laughs> for who, for really what? Badass. For the yeah, druid I don't know. Agency. He's more of a say, don't don't show badass. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not really... Yeah, I guess, from my point of view, he's sitting there eating, he's work. cowering in fear, eating yeah, a fucking eating thing of pineapples. Or tuna. Yeah, yeah. That's, it's like what okay. it looks like. Is there a uh, yeast in that? Uh, no, I haven't been infected. Oh, okay. I do have yeast in here. I told Nell that infected. I was going to make an offering. What? She was attacked by mushroom men. We don't men. know that. Well, no, she was not. She, and she we could, could have got away, her. but uh, Pop over here kicked her, and she she was out Why cold. Why the fuck would you say it like that? <laughs> that is so. It's that is not my power. It was good intentions. To be it's fair. because of my power that they wanted to assassinate now my lover. They tried to break wow. my heart forever. I wasn't able to tell oh. Nell the truth because I wanted to protect her. Instead, I told her I was her. going to make an offering to the great druid for their favor. So. But they've stolen that power, and now it has me reevaluating what I'm doing. How power? What can you show us your power? Are you like doing? Kind yeah. of <laughs> no, the so great you're... druid stole it from me. Not, every last drop it looks like is not you're... even like a crumb of power. I left. had to develop a way to control any animal or tree that was in these lands. Uh, and the try... fact that I became so druidically powerful scared the great druid as well as others. Can you control an ant or something? I could control many ants like colonies. <laughs> like max of five at a time. Yeah, like five, yeah. Um, like a squad of five really ants. big colonies. There's yeah. you, But if you get an ant big enough, that's like ten small ants. Yeah. <laughs> it was nuts, guys. Wow, that's awesome. Well, and they well, couldn't yeah, handle well, it. I wish I met that guy. Well, can you well, like use that power to... Uh, yeah, help? No, he said he lost oh, you it. Lost yeah, all yeah, your power. I yeah, only I ever buff. used it to help these this forest what is this forest <clears throat> this forest is known as the sea of green here in the dermuba triangle oh yeah i forgot we're in the Dur dermuba triangle i'm sorry sea. do you have any credentials at it's all like a building. piece of paper saying you're a druid or something like yeah. I just, it's a whole you look, look like a homeless his, guy eating him. cans of, of tuna like all druids look like. I, i'm part of the secret strategic support branch of the druid defense agency and you, SSS. I, I have to hide myself to fight terrors of the deep across the Great Goblin. Okay, well, that's actually, that's a cool title once again, but not really. So what, what is SS. your current, what are you doing? Something attacked my wagon. Uh, the other <clears throat> two druids went to go seek help and... They are gone. They are dead. Oh my. They've been infected and they've been... <laughs> I don't even know that. Do Uninfected. They've been cured. <laughs> They've been, we cured them. We set them free. Hmm. Well, but your wife is fine it, for now. Right. The only thing to do is go to the great druid. What, where is that? He's at the top of Mount Elty. I can lead you and show you the way. Uh, or I could just give you the map I have. Whatever you prefer, I guess. Can we take a quick five? Yeah. <laughs> Huddle, guys. Let's talk huddle. This uh, hey, wait. Before we go huddle, I just want you. I just want you to know. I want to buy your sundial, and <clears throat> we, you start thinking of a price while we go over here and huddle. All right. Ooh, how about the ring? Is the yeah, ring you, for sale? Is that? Yeah. It. What else you got? What else you got? Give us a little three sixty. I could use another. Uh, ring. Got, what's that like little cape yeah. thing? I like that little. I like that little horn. That horn bandana. Yeah, bandana. Small set of antlers on it. It's got kind of a around my that would look bad as a so. baby dude, because then he would have antlers, and then you kind of have like the horns in your hair, yeah, kind of like everything. a stretched oh, out shit, puka yeah. shell necklace, a silver ring, and a sundial wristwatch. Wait, puka that shell works in necklace? The moonlight. Yeah, but it's all they're spaced out really far. Oh, uh, like eh. a candy necklace, but made of puka yeah. shell. It's Whoa. it's long though. Maybe we could. I could. Shorten it up and make a real puka shell necklace. Yeah, tight. Yeah, skin tight. 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 All right. Uh, yeah. Anyways, yeah. We're gonna go talk. You you mold that over. Uh, um, are, are we away yet? Can he? Can he still hear? <laughs> he can't hear you. He can't or can't. No, you guys are uh, outside of the wagon now. Yeah, we're like a hundred <laughs> yards away. <laughs> um. 
Yeah, do you guys like want to bring him or do you just want to get his map? <laughs> I don't I don't know because like he's a good Sherpa. If we bring him, we don't have to read a map all the time and we don't have to And he knows the place. But then he's Yeah, but then also like I feel like there's just gonna be some sort of twist <laughs> with him, you know? I feel like he's gonna have he's he kind of just seems like a bum. Yeah. But he kind of seems like a real. I mean, he's fucking got a husband. cool. He's got that cool <laughs> sundial, and he's got that cool hat. He's not a, not in fucking ten seconds. He ain't. He <laughs> yeah. just, yeah. A man, look yeah. at him through a lens uh, of sundialness and uh, possibly. He was completely stripped yeah. naked. <laughs> Would you still want him to come? And then with beaten, <laughs> beaten with yeah. batons. With a look Would he of look fear cool? in his eyes. That's the yeah. man. No one. It'd be hard us. for anyone to look cool. <laughs> I mean, he comes with free food. I like a shitload Does, of tuna. Oh yeah. It, you know? yeah, it smells like tuna. Does he have like more of that? I don't know. Do we even eat? <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> <is> <laughs> <a meal? In laughs> I don't eat. I don't consume mortal things like that. Somebody. I don't really. <laughs> Dude, I'm uninterested. I have just realized how famished I am. <laughs> yeah. uh, oh fuck! Eight I months ago, water. I walked so out with fuck. one day's worth of rations. <laughs> We ate some chicken, chicken or something. I, 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 we, you have that onion. <laughs> we have oh, that yeah. stinky apple. I've had that goddamn stinky, spicy <laughs> apple for like, for literally six months. <laughs> it's probably growing more of them in your bag. Yeah. It's gross, dude. Um, fuck. The tree. I don't. I honestly, I'm good either way. It's. I'll leave well, it up to you guys. He might be like. He might be like cannon fodder too. Yeah, we could we could just send him back to his wife and then yeah, cannon fodder. Maybe the great druid will wake really, his powers. I don't know. Uh, I remember right now that I don't know who I am. Uh, I don't know. We can't have cannon fodder. Yeah. Uh, Not cannon fodder, but like um a, a fifth or I'm yeah sorry, yeah a fourth uh, another a fourth man, hand an extra help would help in in a combat. Fourth, a fourth hand, and I look down at Baby Duke and I's four arms combined. Yeah. Oh. Man, it does make well, one then how, stronger. Well, then however many extra hands we would have. Six my, arms. My arithmetic ain't so good. <laughs> you are not looking good, and yeah. you, Jerry, are looking insane. What? It might not be a bad idea for me to have a guy on the team yeah, that's just like not slowly being That's the most changed. sane guy. That's the sanest that's, guy you've met in a while. <laughs> Second to me, if dude. You're, if you. you see that guy and you go, that's the sane, <laughs> rational ally <laughs> I need. <laughs> you can't take your suit that off and you're turning into a mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> you, guys are not, you guys are honestly I'm not I'm surprised great. you haven't like, bolted in the night. <laughs> just fucking ran, I'm, ran well, into well, my, like, my my Greenvale friends would love to talk. They would, they would love to have me. But I'm going to... No, i got to see this through a little bit. Because my duty... My honor. Um, uh, that's a funny word. All right, yeah, let's go back and talk to him. What if we didn't come to you? <laughs> We're bringing him with us. Yeah, bring him, yeah. Bring yeah, bring him, him with, with us. us. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. yeah. If, if anything, I want to hear more about this guy's accomplishments and accolades. Yeah, yeah accolades. I love Listen, hearing about I've it. been working as a freelance druid lately for many circles, making incalculable amounts of gold on many various covert assignments. And I've been giving the money away to support charities all over the world, orphanages, hospitals, and schools to support the evacuees of natural catastrophes all over the Great Goblin. Oh, like that earthquake. You've... Like Greenvale. I was going to say, you've heard of the disaster of Greenvale. Uh, Give me a roll. This guy, by the oh. way, is oh. the... Oh, wait, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I need He's them the rolls. <clears throat> Perception. Fuck. What is that? It's an eight plus... One. Nine. <laughs> Girthquake. Right. Hugh and Jerry. Oh, huh? oh, oh, I'm rolling guys. too? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was him because oh. it's his past. Yeah. Like his little no, 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 no. gobble I, memory. I do feel like, by the way, that got since he's like one three. of the only survivors of the Greenville accident, like if you have any money, you know, support fund. That's what, dude, I'm... Listen, I'm getting there. Yeah. Okay, it's better to come from my lips than yours. Slava no offense, because uh, no, look because insane. Cause then it seems like you're you're not like asking for it. You know, it, it's me pointing out. I guess you're... there is a there's merit in that. Yeah. Yeah. The, I'm sorry. What did you get, Hugh? Oh, twenty-four. No, it's fourteen. Okay. Plus what though? Isn't it perception? No, no, that's it's it's a pass. Oh, I got a three. So what? How do I do? So. <laughs> 
Yeah, don't even look you. up your voice. My guy's just dr- sitting here drooling. <laughs> <laughs> Amidst the strange spell of sounds Oops. that Breen seems to be casting endlessly, Hugh, you find a flotation device out amongst the meaningless I... whirlpool of words and cling to it. A crackling of branches and breaking against the background, and a stench of sickly sweet shug mixed with funky fungus floods your nose. A stink of a hundred stanks outlines the periphery of your smelling senses and alerts you to something even through the monotony of Breen's seemingly endless explanation. You believe whatever crossed his path from before is returned, and it seems to be moving at a rapid rate. You may take one action. Force field! Put up a force field! Smell something. Damn, now right we're hidden, mid, guys. Mid sentence. Yeah. Oh wait, somebody it, just I sucked it back up, up. dude. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh my oh, god. Hey, look. Jesus. Um, that doesn't well, really. I can't see shit, yeah, dude. It what do you mean? Help anybody? Look, yeah. <laughs> yeah. God, it's, I it's just like really wanted an excuse to use that. I I'm sorry. That. I, I can't use it. Can. Yeah. I fog breathed and it should cover us in some sort of uh, fogginess. I can't see. Yeah, I can't see. yeah it's like screaming. Uh, fog cloud. You create a 20 foot radius sphere of fog centered on a point within range. So you just did it on yourself. I just puked on my mouth. own goddamn feet. Yeah. yeah. And then and then I'm going to say, I'm going to say, boys, I did that because I think something might be attacking <laughs> us. I smell danger. Yeah, that true. my my spidey You're like sense a good went detective. Yeah. A fungal bear bursts through the briar, chipping at its fungal fur before blowing a chunk of mushroomy mass through the Breen machine where the druid once huddled. During the passionate delivery of his speech, Breen had stepped closer towards you and managed to move out of the way of what surely would have been his doom. Y'all can roll initiative. He's gonna start. It's oh shit, we got a clomping with its fungal toes all around. He gets to you want me to roll for initiative oh, or just no, 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 you're gonna one start first. Alright, I gotta roll it in a in a container. <clears throat> one. Oh shit. A I'm, one. Epic dude, I am just a one plus one. Wait, two. you have an initiative number? Yeah. My initiative's plus one. Yeah, if on D and D Beyond, it's by your armor class. Some people have like oh, higher initiatives. I got plus initiatives. two and I got a 13. So 15. Nice. I didn't know you had. I didn't, 15, that's a pretty good number. That's a. Uh, do you want to roll one for Baby Duke or just have Baby Duke go after you? You can just go after me. Damn, you just say rolling a zero. I like well, keeping him. Yeah, he rolled it. It kind of makes sense. Yeah, it's hard for him to. Until eventually I get a chain that goes around his <laughs> neck and keeps him where he can shoot off of me and do attacks, and then I can pull him back in. Oh, the 10 foot chain could have been used so well right there. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so let's see. Turn order is going to be Hugh, <laughs> Baby, Fungal Bear, Fungal um, Baby Dukes. What about Brienne? He'll get a turn. I guess he doesn't oh, yeah. do shit, right? Uh, yeah, he's more so cowering. Uh, so we'll, we'll see. We'll see what he's up Bastard. to. What a hard ass. If him or Richter Kane come into play at all, we can slap him on the end of Baby right. Duke. Okay. Actually, I'll even say that. Because... Are Chip and Chunk here? Or nah, they're the back camp? in house. Okay. Uh, or, <laughs> I don't know how you're going to signal to him, but maybe you could, you could figure it out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and then... News team assemble. <laughs> so Hugh, what do you want um, to do? Uh, I think <laughs> I might push oh, the I... limits of my Gundam suit here. Oh and fuck! Is there any way I can turn my hands into like T one thousand points? You want to try to influence the suit to to make yes. yourself spikes? To ma- yeah, to hand spikes. Yeah, and we'd be yeah. like Chester. If I if Anti-bear if spikes. I get fucked up, that means you get fucked up. You're gonna have to work with me here, buddy. Come on, you can handle make that. hand spikes. Battle mode. Yeah, and then um, uh, is this bear near me? Yeah, it's right next to you guys. Okay, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do some around. sort of two-handed uh, stabbing attack. All right, we can do that. We like rolled this. What what does this fog do to us? We're just standing in the midst of it, <laughs> and it stinks uh, real bad. <laughs> you can tell because it like, it's green. 
<laughs> well, like, will the bear be able to attack me though? Or like, oh, yeah, I guess we could just walk away. I don't know. If we, could do that. <laughs> so we can't escape. Uh, Put, okay. He's attracted to the tuna. <laughs> yeah. throw it. Maybe we throw a can of tuna one way and then yeah. run, the, run the other. It's definitely obscuring the fungal bear from being able to see you guys. Okay. Also, just adding to the terrifying Wait, there, situation. Uh, that a good thing. I haven't said a word yet since it's, I'm I'm complete. I know exactly what to do in the. If a bear attacks. Have you seen that movie, The Edge? <laughs> no. Uh -huh. Okay. The Edge is 17. Fuck. Yeah, Nine. Uh, what did you do? I I attempted to just stab him <laughs> okay. with my hands, with my spike hands. Cool. The little Bruce Lee fucking one inch punch yeah. right in his little <clears throat> titty. Yeah, you're still able so to hit cool. with Chester. Sweet. So oh, really? 1d4 plus 4 damage. 1d4? Oh, I need to Wait, roll he a, hit? A d4? Yeah, he still hit. Does he get advantage too? Because he's obscured or no? Uh, no. Oh, he damn. just gets a hit because Chester has a lot of plus when he's being extended like that to hit. Alright, RP off. I got a question. What's up? Four? I have, uh, I have like my fucking passive. I, I can like help action people. What does that do? Like, how do I give that to him or something? Yeah, that's four. I can aid an ally in attacking. That could have been useful. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Well, it has to be within active active advantage. Advantage. It so has to be within 30 feet. So if you were next to somebody feet. trying to do something, yeah, if you were next to somebody trying to get help them do something, then you could give them advantage by helping. And I think you'd probably call that before I do my roll. Yes, okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. hey, next time Oh, wait, I that's a high buddy. roll? Yeah, put it on there. Yeah. Granted, I don't. I think I've given out bardic inspiration like one time, and it's like no. the main feet of a bard. <laughs> Okay, so you're for eight. How much damage does a bear right, like even you have? Describe how you hit. Go for it. Uh, yeah, that's why I was gonna bring up that movie, The Edge. If you haven't seen it, excellent movie. Uh, there's a moment in it where they sharpen a big stick and they kill a bear with it. And the bear comes up on its hind legs, and then they like use the the weight of the bear to come down on the spike and gore it. So I was mm. gonna like come up underneath its belly and go like yeah, like straight up in the air with my hands, get it in the gut. T1000 style. So. Yep. All right, and then it is JB's turn. You stabbed him. Four damage. Damn. <laughs> yeah. Four plus four, so it's eight. Does he have any weak and points? Just kind of like standing underneath it, going. Oh, Probably shit. its heart. Does it? Does it like yeah. have like? Because look, he has like beating shit out of like. Could His I, how stomach much? has definitely been weakened. It's it's more rotten in that area. Or yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's why I stabbed. T one thousand hand Chester just ripped it open. So you'd probably do more damage if you were going for it. Did yeah. any fall in my he open mouth? While I was under it. Yeah. Heart. Their weak points. Yeah, if you <laughs> remove their brain and eyes and heart, they're they can't. completely defenseless. Wow. <laughs> Shit, son. Okay. Uh, fuck. All right. Well, what the hell? Uh, I could try to punch it, but I could also stab it with my little rapier. Rapier. I, I could take my little rapier and fucking try to stab him right in the gut. I guess the weak spot. I didn't know if that wasted a, a, a skill, but yeah. Sure. Mean, Wait, like skill. a three musketeer, like yeah. rapier? Like you have like a little a, a foil? Like a little... yeah, I have a little rapier and a bow. Like, its stomach it's... is torn open. It's not gonna do shit. You're just poking it with a little stick. Well, that's what I was waiting it's for. I was, that's why I was asking for a weak spot because I could stab no, him right in the eyeball dot. or something. I don't know where it is. That's what I was asking. I, that's, I don't know if I could like percept it with a turn or like how it works. That's what I was asking. Oh yeah, percept. You know what I mean? Like, could I see it? I see the I see gut fungus, and I just fucking try to stab at it. Right? So maybe it explodes. I don't know. If you want to, don't know. Do, it's an unknown. Uh, if you want to do like a medicine check or something <laughs> like that, Is that okay? Uh, to try to see a weak point in its anatomy. Fuck it, I'm just gonna stab you him go for the, the big festering <laughs> open hole. Yeah. yeah, you have your suspicion that the gaping hole in its stomach might be a weak point where all the organs are held. <laughs> kind of loosely held together by mycelium. That when, might be the spot. I'm gonna try to hit him in the heart. Then. But you're not a doctor. I'm gonna hit him in the heart. Give me a roll. Okay. No, I thought you'd just give me that. All right, fine. Wait, hold on. You rolled it. Hit. <laughs> hold on. Got a 15 plus, uh, plus, what is this, a dex weapon? Yeah. That's plus two, bitch. That's 17. That's a big yeah, hit. That's, that's it. I mean, that? that's, that's a, a hit. Your rapier does 1d8 damage. So. 1d8 plus two. It says in the description plus two. We cannot sleep on that. Plus two is the hit. So you get like a plus two on top of your 17 that you got or whatever. 
Oh, that's, that's, yeah, that's a 19? No. Oh, wait. That would just be the plus that yeah, you get. That was not, you don't add your dexterity. No, 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 no. Like, on the rapier description, it says damage 1d8 plus 2. That's what I was talking about. Oh, uh, then, yeah, it's 1d8 and then add 2 to it. Oh, bitch. All right. Yeah, that All right big good. number. Big number. Okay, I got a 1. Uh, plus 2, that's, <laughs> three. that's 3. That's 3 big numbers <laughs> right there. So you, def you definitely knew the spot yeah, you where you wanted that to You hyped that up, too. <laughs> You're like, this number plus this number. Really and focused. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, Ego. And you get the idea you were in the right area, but just not quite the right kind of strike. Because uh, it seemed mostly irritated by the stab, not severely damaged. Oh. Fuck. The Thanks, Brian. Bear. You irritated him. <laughs> and then it turns to you yeah, in doing. its fungly rage. No. Yeah. Wait, he knows I'm there? I figured it's my big, long fucking arm just came out of the smoke. He doesn't know, right? Or is he gonna... He follows that long arm back. Oh, oh, yeah. God. The big blue flame is a huge indicator. <laughs> that would yeah. go both ways if you want to do it like that. Because then, right. like, how the fuck do you know where it is? That's true. I probably, yeah, and I probably look like a big blue light in the middle of the gas or whatever. Like, <laughs> Bob, on the other hand, is like a ghost because he's green inside yeah. the green yeah. smoke. And I haven't made a peep. Yeah. And it's, just, yeah, it's, just like a, it's just like a tiny little floating man, just a little baby dude. <laughs> yeah. I, I'm like an anglerfish. <laughs> Comes for that bit, little man. I need you to roll a Constitution save. JB I Lynn. save. Oh my God! What is a save? Okay. Just just roll a dice. Twenty. Is be, that a twenty dice? Yes, sir. And, and add one, one to it, which is your bonus. Okay. I got a one. <laughs> <laughs> so. As you retract oh, from explode. your stab wound, <laughs> with spores unfamiliar to yourself, for the amount of spores you've inhaled, you really think you would have covered your mouth by this point, but you just can't resist. And spores <laughs> eject from the bear's open wound and go into you, and you You're find so yourself fun, beginning yeah. to hallucinate, hallucinating <laughs> to the point where you can't control yourself and you are incapacitated, you will have oh, to make Jesus saving Christ. throws at the end of your turn oh each time to get out God. of this. God. This is like <laughs> fear, fear toxin for you. <laughs> Dude, it's like it's and like breaking bad. Remember, that was a and one. You think you're a, <laughs> you, rolled a one. you think you're a witch a from the 1800s. <laughs> I I, dude, I'm like I, at this point, I've been injected so much. It's like Breaking Bad. I'm like, I already got cancer, Hank. I'm like, I don't give a <laughs> shit. <laughs> Fuck it, dude. Uh, okay, I'm so going sweaty. to. Um, can you lay me out a little? Like, I'm just in the fog, and the bear's like by me. Yep. Okay. You're out of the way <laughs> okay, far good... enough. It burst oh. through the wagon. JB <laughs> took a, a stab at it. And it JB's just drew his ground. Eye. <laughs> you can still see where it was based on the action and things that were happening, but you're, you're a couple feet away. Okay. I'm going to ready my trusty suck ass weapon i'm gonna pull out the boomerang <laughs> so i don't want to get too close to this thing <laughs> even though i got Old this badass new reliable. harpoon i'm pulling Both out hands yeah. on the hilt of the, the harpoon and yeah. the boomerang and then I'm, i have both hands on it and then i feel two small baby hands over my hands and they say no use this and he hands me the boomerang and i'm going to I'm gonna, I'm gonna like take like ten feet. I'm gonna like walk like ten feet back first. <laughs> You're just gonna throw it like aimlessly into the cloud, knowing where it's in there. <laughs> it's a fucking wooden boomerang. It's not gonna. Worst case, you get hit by a boomerang. Oh, I it's not it was gonna like do much. Mad Max style, where it's like I can go to catch it and cut off my fingers. I don't think so. <laughs> no, I think you it's never just know a boomerang. anything happened in that smoke. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Breaks your fingers. I'm. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna walk like a little. Give myself some distance. All right. And then I'm gonna attempt a boomerang throw. Let's do it. Um. Get a help action, you. <laughs> just. Yeah. Fuck. fuck. Uh, what do you? What <laughs> help action? You just. I'm out. Like, I'm out. The scene cool. from Ghost. You're just Patrick Swayze directly behind you him. You can do it. Uh, <laughs> a twenty. A twenty. Woo. Yeah. So I crit. Yeah, you crit. I wish I was using the fucking javelin yeah. <laughs> three times. Great. Yeah. God damn it! Big number coming. Okay. Uh, wait. Now what do I? Oh, now I roll my d4 of damage. Yeah, we're actually gonna have so an overhaul soon. 
Well, we wanted things to be more intense. So basically, this this should be some kind of devastating blow. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So we'll, I'm going to we'll let you describe it, and then it's going to just do a flat amount of of damage. Or al like alternatively, I think we should have you roll. Uh, what's can I do more than four like damage? Like a four times multiplier or something. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. We'll multiply. Yeah. Let's see. Even... Because crits should be, you know. A lot. It's I rare. want them to be a lot more. We're gonna go for kind of a more intense crit, higher and on the lower kind well, of, end of the you spectrum. Roll 20s so a lot with the okay. rolling a twenty with this is is probably almost killing this beast. Okay, you're, then you're I'm gonna doing, describe. It, it is gonna be a hell of a shot. Some steez, then. Okay, <laughs> I before I actually start walking away, I pull, I grab the boomerang. Okay, I wipe it on the brow. I I fling it and then I. I'm going right for a head chop off with a wood boomerang. And then I turn around and then I start walking away and I hold my hand up and it comes back perfectly into my hand and I tuck it into the front of my pants. And I have, I don't know if he killed it or what, because I'm not even looking. I throw it and I immediately walk away to the catch point. Yeah. But I'm going for a, what I want to happen is for it to completely cut its head off. <laughs> and return his head to you. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah. And return that head on top of it. <laughs> and your, your wish is nearly granted as oh, its head I stays cut its dangling. Throat. Uh, you yeah. cut right across the base of its throat, and it's choking and sputtering blood, but <laughs> it God. seems that whatever mushroom growths have gone along its spine and up its brain are still holding the last little ligaments in place. The head is just all over the place. So. Oh, okay, well, well, then when I catch it, I say, Ooh, that was grisly. <laughs> and I tuck it in my pants, and I start walking away. Oh, that's badass. <laughs> I'm just going yeah. to keep walking. And as you, as you do that, it stumbles <laughs> to the ground, uh, barely able to right itself. Oh, shit. Barely. Barely. Feet. He's <laughs> barely alive. <laughs> so now it's my turn. Yeah, this one's this one's uh, a fucking what's, alley oop, what's, dude. Just it's actually <laughs> Baby Duke's turn, but uh, <laughs> oh yeah, Baby Baby oh, Duke, Baby, baby Duke, Duke go. just uh, <laughs> run into the smoke and cut his head off. <laughs> yeah, uh, if uh, if you needs nobody this else more. said it before, but it, it looks like he's uh, barely alive. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Original yes. joke by me, Baby Duke. Yes, uh, I'm too far to attack though, so I'm gonna <laughs> hang out here. And it goes to Richter Kane's turn, this. and Richter Kane mm -hmm. is just sitting on the <laughs> ground. He doesn't know awesome there's anything happening. <laughs> and uh, then it's dirt. Breen's turn, and Breen appears to... He suddenly gets courageous. <laughs> uh, he says something as he's hidden under the bits of wagon, and he produces Probably some kind of pun. Uh, magical shillelagh appears in his hand, but he doesn't appear to go anywhere, so he just sits there underneath, uh, letting letting things go. A magical Maybe he can't see That's through the awesome. smoke, you know? <laughs> I kind of wanted him to kill Steel like it and boast about it, I'll yeah. be honest. <laughs> <It's> funny. <laughs> it's back to Hugh, yeah. Okay, what's uh, what's going on with JB? Is he injured or what? I'm, I'm fucking, I'm, I'm out, dude. I'm out of it. <laughs> he's dude, he's gone, maybe. man. You gotta, you gotta yeah, let him go. <laughs> what, he's what's basically ranting he's... about how he shouldn't have bought water shoes or such a cheap backpack yeah. or something. So yeah. he, he is coherent. Piece of shit backpack. A different life, yeah. No, he's hallucinating hard. Oh, but he's but he's, not he's, he's like moving around trip. and stuff. Yeah. Are you gonna like throw? What? Are you... I imagine I'm just sitting there, fucking screaming. Yeah, he's incapacitated. Ranting. He's, yeah. he's, 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 so, uh, like, so what are my chances uh, of being able to yank that, tail, yank that little glove dirtbag off grease ball. his hand while he's out of it? Oh. You could give it a try. And that bear ain't gonna get me? He, You said he he fell to the <laughs> ground. You said it. It's still definitely alive. It's alive, though, but I might have enough chance to, uh, some time to run up there and grab that glove. You could. If you run towards it, you might... Pro Provoke an attack of opportunity. I'm willing to risk. <laughs> yeah. You got plenty of health. Yeah, I got plenty of health. Okay. Yeah, do it. Hi. Baby. 16. Plus what? What am I doing? I'm stealing a glove. What is that? Dexterity? Yeah, well, slide of hand. Slide it's of plus hand. two, either way. So eighteen. 
Yeah, you're able to. Pretty good. See, oh, shit. You're able to definitely <laughs> oh, grab the glove. <laughs> you are nothing now, Brian. You're oh, nothing. My God. <laughs> you should help me. <laughs> I would say Somebody that help. it's starting to move, but I would say that uh, Jerry Beetleman should get a chance to roll against it. He's not even in his right mind. Well, I gotta roll a fucking what's that thing called? A uh, saving saving throw. throw. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll say you're at a disadvantage a because you're incapacitated. Oh my god! All right. <laughs> what, is, what, what do I, what right, do I have to roll. give you a dex? I want a dice it? cam on this shit. Yeah. Where's your <laughs> dice cam, bro? I'm lie about this. Why would I lie? Nat twenty. All right. Because you talk about you how much you're gonna you lose your only glove. item. Yeah. You talk about it all the time. Bro, I have like six sleight of hand. I'm just gonna yank it back. <laughs> I don't give a shit, dude. All right, I'm here. gonna bolt this thing onto my fucking wrist. Mm. <laughs> okay, I got an eight. And then, so, <laughs> is that? Uh, let's see. <sighs> that glove's looking good. Whole, I hope his whole hand comes off with it. <laughs> you have to deal with that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, so as you start to move it, it starts to burn your hands, but you're able to take it off. Can I in the slip, Chester suit. Can I slip it over my hand? Yeah. <laughs> I want it on. You have it on. Okay. Jesus Christ. Is there any blood around here? Well, you're gonna go full feral. I'm gonna go full feral. And, the, what? Uh, good thing I started walking away, dude. I'm fucking out of here. I am going bear. to rip this bear's head off. That's the oh, last man. thing I do. Barely. You could have done that with your regular yeah, hand. Yeah, this is way cooler because it's like stolen badass weaponry. I guess. And it, the only instance of this thing being used was forever ago. Yeah. And I want to see exactly, because there was a lot of... Yeah, Jerry doesn't know how to use he it. Just, he just used it once and never said anything. I want to see what the power is. I used it twice, actually. But yeah. I, I would touch it. I, I would touch other liquids the face, with and it. I think the second time was against the train thing. Oh. Train mech. Okay, well, I want, I want to dip my knuckles into the blood and fucking... But preemptively, I'm thinking about attacking that bear. I'm like, I'm going for the bear! And I dip him in. Well, it. someone's going to steal that. Um, somebody's going to take that kill before you get there. You're just, you're, so you're grabbing the glove, sliding on your hand, and then <laughs> dipping it in the blood that is next to the bear and Jerry Beetleman. Yeah, I don't know if I can and do all that in one turn. It. Uh, it seems like a, a, a big chain first of First one's things. kind of a movement. <laughs> and then... I guess Stay. it's a minor action and a major action. Well, major action would be taking it. Minor action would be dipping it. I would say that's dual. Okay. And then... Oh, God, yeah. Somebody's going to kill the bear, and then I'm just going to be going sicko mode in the camp. Yeah, I don't think you really thought that through, but yes, you touch the glove to the blood. Do you have something to say, Bob? I'm waiting for my turn, dude. I'm going right, to... Can you guys I'm deafen fucking out of here. Oh, God. Yeah. I have to deafen. Yeah. Yeah. You got to don't, don't I know how it works? You do, but you this don't. Is, yeah. yeah. Oh boy, what have I done? <laughs> uh, so you can basically hold anything now in terms of fire as long as it's in the, the golden or you don't <clears throat> I mean you don't really know that actually. Uh, but what you do feel is some personality is being channeled through the glove and as you wear it you feel yourselves possessed by some kind of charismatic wrestling entity uh, you're not sure of what their name is but uh, you initially start to just kind of lose all control of yourself and you're going to need to make a wisdom save real quick is that a, is that a d20? yeah yeah and you have minus one to your wisdom I ain't the wisest, you know. So this, this something is trying to kind of take control oh. of mine. <laughs> 15 minus 1, that's 14. So 14. You're able to repress it to I a certain extent, but eventually it takes hold. And you, this. you feel you mind. the spirit of the blue the angel. So it's, you need to charismatic, wow, wow, ah, kind of, ooh. Ooh, ah, you're not sure exactly who this wrestler was, but you get the idea that they at least thought they were hot stuff. Okay, you should listen to the like song a, Where like, Do I Go do I just, do I by Max B. Control over Parenthesis, barbecue music. Nah, you need to attack whoever's closest. Hey, 
Who is closest to me in this instance? Jerry. <laughs> nice. <All right. laughs> We call this a comeuppance. <laughs> Hello. Oh, oh. I need one. <laughs> How are things over here? Uh, we're doing just fine. <laughs> we are uh, doing fine. Okay. Hey, Bizzle, you watched some of that Wrestling Empire video, right? Yeah, it was really good. You remember the you know the barber shop, the end of the barber shop <laughs> round? Yes. Um, uh, I think it's like it was like broke Mark shaking hands with like Biff Small Wiener and then goes into the surprise <laughs> stunner. <laughs> yeah. Are you going to try that? Dude, I have encyclopedic <laughs> knowledge of every one of your videos and now I know exactly what's going to happen. I mean, I do remember that one because I just watched it. So. <laughs> yeah. Oh, of course, when Barf Wiener goes for the roundhouse. It, it's such an insane ending when to like Barf, the first fight. Uh, Barf Wiener? <laughs> Was that his name? We we, we, we had Barf Wiener. Hey, what the fuck? It's probably too low for how I didn't even. Biff Small Wiener. Oh, Biff Small Wiener. Wiener. Barf Wiener should have fought. (laughs) Barf Wiener would have been the ultimate counter to him. Yeah. Uh. Do we have a guest tomorrow, Sam? No, I was trying to get that PI and it didn't work. I've got two. Good stories. Not really be real stories. Quick while we wait for Brian. It's probably 20 go? seconds of... I, oh, I've no. been <laughs> scammed twice. Oh, of course. One leaves. In the past week, Hello? I've lost $200 in $100 bills. Because oh. they've been all I've had in my wallet from you and Devin giving me hundreds <laughs> from the casino. And I've had two instances where I'm like, yeah, I got you. And then I open my wallet and I'm like, oh, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I could have sworn I had a 20 in here. <laughs> uh, it's been awful. Also, my lawn is fucked. <laughs> in a non-shocking turn of fate, there are little strips of dead grass everywhere. <laughs> uh. It looks like it's like zebra'd my lawn. Because <laughs> after like one day, my roommate's like, it's actually not that bad. And then like two days later, I'm like, oh, dude, I'm so fucking sorry. <laughs> it's really ugly. And the... The dandelions are everywhere. They're growing in the dead grass. It's like such a slap in the face. So it, it ignored the, the roundup, yeah. the thing you were trying to it, get rid of. I think it might have just been purely grass killer. Oh God, Brian just disintegrate? As soon as one of you gets back. Oh. Oh, there you go. <clears throat> <laughs> uh, wait, who, whose turn is it? It is JB's turn. Aren't I like out or something? <laughs> uh, you need to you roll your. Roll. I got a fourteen plus one yeah. constitution. Let's see. And you're able to break out of it. You're no right, longer what, what do I see around me? Uh, you look to your hand, <laughs> one carrying your buckler, and the yeah. other is bare, and you see the frame of you in the Chester suit with the flaming blue towering glove on. over you. Uh, Pretty much directly under the fungal bear. Mm-hmm. Wait, the, the bear or who? Yeah, the bear is right next to both of you. All right, well, do I, see, he was just, I see Hugh. Is he distracted? And he just put the <laughs> glove into the blood. It turned red, and then a distinct change came about, and a wild look came into his eyes. I'm going to take my rapier, poke red... him in the back of the head with, a, with my rapier. <laughs> yeah, the bear just I'm going on a solo adventure. Right? It's <laughs> what is Which one? This is like the end of the fucking Lord of the Rings. Yeah, 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 I want my glove back. That's Fighting all I'm over the ring. Bite his, his hand at. off. Bite his finger off. I got off. eyes on the. I got eyes on the back of the glove. I go through the front of the suit. I'm gonna poke the head. I came back. That's gonna be the. I mean, yeah, you're allowed. I can't steal it, right? Is it possible to slide a hand it? I don't think I can. You could try to slide a hand it back. Yeah, you could. Do you? You could just assume that he did it as like to defend us. Is it like untouchable or some shit? I don't know. I guess you're what are your What are out. your thoughts as Jerry when you wake up? Because do you does he know that he saw you do it, or is he too fucked I up? I mean, I, I looked around. And I now saw he's just him like, with my oh, yeah, but maybe he's like protecting you. No, I don't believe that. That guy's a rat. <laughs> <laughs> like, why, would, why would I think he's protecting me? He's been eyeing it up. Because I, I went after the bear with it, you dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> All I give a shit is about my glove. <laughs> 
Okay, so you're too obsessed with your whole identity is tied into it. Am I awesome? Wait, wait if, I, if, I, if I try hat. to stab him in the back of the head, he's not gonna. Is he gonna die? <laughs> it's oh, a rape. Right I can one just way go, to find out. Like, kill him. I'm gonna. Okay, I'd rather slay well, a hand. Okay, I'd try rather to paralyze steal him. it back from him when he's not noticing because it's like I don't want to kill him. Try to kill That'd be him. Insane. <laughs> <laughs> make what? him make a new character. <laughs> yeah, can I give him a lobotomy? Just make him a retard. <laughs> <first? laughs> right up his nose. Go at an angle. Yeah. And get... For a little. Uh, okay. We that would be funny if one of us lobotomized <laughs> someone else while they're sleeping. <laughs> what, what I'm a man prank. of science, dude. I need <laughs> to practice. The brain. All right. Well, I'll, I can dude, cure all I your about cold about chills. I'm, you know, I'm a man of little of little. Uh, a little uh, spine. I'm gonna grab my shit back. Obviously, I'm gonna try to steal it back. <laughs> <laughs> What's gonna happen? What's the worst thing gonna happen? You know? Slide a hand. Slide a hand? Okay. Please, God, if there's ever a roll, let it be this right here. Oh, God, I got a 9 plus 6. <laughs> that's, like, that's 15. <laughs> you have insane slide of hand. What the hell? Yeah. You're yeah. Give me a roll. Me? Yeah. I actually have evidence to back mine up, Brian. Can I, can I ask I in a 9? Fuck. Nine plus uh, so strength. two. Oh, strength? Yeah, you're trying to hold this on. Oh, fuck. Can I just close my goddamn hand? Well, then it's a nine. Plus two, or plus zero, okay. Yeah, you're, you're, <laughs> you have now stolen the glove back that was just stolen <laughs> from oh, you. It's mine! <laughs> but the glove is red, and it stays active, <clears throat> and as you're trying to put it on, it, it burns you, uh, Let's see. Are they going to hurt? Can they die? Can they it's fucking burn die? Love. You get burned I love the idea that it's just damage. now a fight over the glove while there's like a... I can oh. get through this campaign in a week, dude, if these guys both die right here. I can save the world. Four points of damage burning your hand to shove oh, it back God. inside. Yeah, but you know what? I look cool doing it. I look like my glove. <laughs> Does your hand look all weird and wrinkled and tiny when it's out of it or what? Wait, wait you forgot what my hand looked out. like? It's been in there for too long. It's got a, it hasn't seen the sun. I don't know if I can show you my my hand. <laughs> oh, oh, my little doll hand. <laughs> All right. It's got to be hot in there. Oh, that was and short. It, and it is <laughs> red. <laughs> that sucked. That was a big fucking waste of time. Thanks, Brian. <laughs> it's worth it. Oh, see? Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Everything you guys do is a waste of time. <laughs> Dude, P P Poop just got oh, the If you would fucking just use it, I wouldn't go about all these shenanigans. Just fucking use it. And as you argue and fight over the glove, and as a It's a special glove, and it should be used at an appropriate time. I didn't think it was appropriate. That's all I'm saying. It's a giant a bear. A I'm giant bear. Bear. You don't understand what goes into this glove, all right? It's madness, all right? It's madness. I know now. I'm waiting I for the fucking... It for, for 12 yeah. seconds, I experienced it. I'm and waiting for the paper is... to tell me. It, no, it's already taking over. <laughs> you experience it, but you you familiarized yourself previously with this, and so it's not challenging to control yourself. But you feel that personality, that spirit, possess you. But you're also directly in front of the fungal bear, and so is Hugh. And even Chester Cheetah, even spirit, even Chester. with its uh, kind of shambling last attacks here, because your proximity is able to attack both of you. And it does so, lunging in for a bite. Put this thing out of its misery, dude. It's it horrible. It's just... And it hits Hugh. Yes, kill him, kill him. Oh, it hits JB for nine points of damage. Oh, God. dude, I have one and health left. Snaps <laughs> a second bite at Hugh for eleven points of damage. God! Oh, uh, sort of puncturing uh, the Chester suit. Sort of. I've been holding this hand grenade in my bag for like five episodes. This is the perfect time to throw this out there. Is a hand grenade? No. Oh. <laughs> what, what? Wouldn't that be awesome if I can just kill all of you? You said you? eleven points. Right. Correct. Yeah, that's too much. You're gonna have to turn tone that down. Wait, what do you mean? What? Wait, what's your? <laughs> that's too much. There's damage. no way. There's no way you have <laughs> eleven just HP. Said he has one health. <laughs> yeah, I, got brought the, I got brought the one health. I didn't realize he's so fragile. Man up. <laughs> Even if you want to die right away, you get a couple Wait, chances. You got that chain shirt on? No, you should click that chain shirt. 
It wouldn't have changed anything for this one. I think your chain shirt is not like your chain shirt and your uh, shield. I don't know if they're added in your AC. Shirt. Oh, I don't know. I, on D and D Beyond, I did. Yeah. I did wear them. Okay. Well, I, oh, a chain shirt. It's on my. Okay, my AC's thirteen. Yeah, it looks like it's on. Or is it? Yeah. Probably thirteen. That thing. That well, thing saved my life. it says twelve on your actual thing because it oh. says thirteen there and then plus two. Oh, it's with probably your it's buffer. medium so armor. So I don't think 15. it. I don't think it counts. That's why. Just okay, for looks. Okay. I, I, I can't well, I'm gonna, wear. I'm gonna, I'm gonna change that then. You could wear medium. Oh, well, shouldn't it add it then? I don't. I don't know. I don't know how these wizards do these things in this game. This computer. Yeah, my proficiency is in light armor too, but I don't know. Yeah, because I think with the shield, you should actually have 15 AC. Damn, my, my AC is 11. I don't know what AC... Like I, what? I'm a big target, though. AC is like <clears throat> what something has to well, roll to hit you. Uh, okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Uh, and after it snaps across both of you two, it's Pob's turn. Who's standing very coolly at a distance, watching all the shenanigans go down. Yeah, uh... So is Jerry distracted? <laughs> <laughs> dude, I have the adrenaline right now. Dude. I'm more alert than ever. That I've got four sticky sniper fingers. Aiming at the sniper aiming at the yeah, sniper. Yeah. Um, I'm. Uh, is there a tree right next to me? <laughs> Go up it. There yeah, I, I think I. I'm going to just climb like ten feet up a tree. Or like, wait, you're not supposed to climb away from bears that can climb faster, but. I'm I'm going to like is there a, a branch kind of overlooking this where I can kind of brood up there? Yeah, you could. Uh, okay, I'd like to climb to a gargoyle stand at a branch nearby. All right. Uh, and I'm going to be kind of judging. That's badass, dude. Between that and Thanks. you and the green uh, smoke, you're like check. Nightcrawler or something. Oh, yeah, that's awesome, yeah. actually. Okay, uh, get this out. Plus one. 14. Yeah, you're able to make it up that tree. It's not really any problem. Cool. I, in one fell leap, I jump, I bound 40 meters in the air. <laughs> uh, I scamper up it because I've got four arms, so it's really easy for me to climb up shit. <laughs> and Baby Duke helps, obviously, with his little daggers. He's stabbing into the tree like little ice picks. And I climb up to a branch and I look down on you guys and I say, such childish, ch childish things. Uh, <laughs> I mean, something cooler than that. Oh, what, what's going on? What the hell? Yes. <laughs> uh, yes. It's, it's the sharpening the knives against each other. Yes, we assume we will feast. <laughs> <My son. laughs> uh, the body of Richter Kane just is still sitting <laughs> oh, there. <shit. laughs> the bear's like, one, green, one of you guys yeah, is going to kill it. I'm just going in for the attack here. I, I don't <laughs> want to be up with fucked. His up. He takes a swing at the backside of the bear. And he completely misses. He whips the shillelagh. This is what I'm worried swing. about. I'm going to be down there. Straight into his leg. And he takes two points of damage. <laughs> it is, it, it's like jamming his shin into it. His it's swing cheery. was pretty weak, so. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he, was, he was on the other side. <laughs> and it so is funny. Hugh's turn. Um, I'm rolling for that. I'm taking the glove back. Yeah, no. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you guys should keep you should try to take it back. Come on. Are you pissed off? I don't have like any weapons except for Don't you have like a Those sword? spike arms did more damage than anything I have. Oh yeah, did. that's true. I forgot about the spike arms. Cryo's cry is also a sword. So. Yeah, you also have a yeah. prophesized I'm bow not sword. Yeah, but like for the finishing blow on something that's basically dead, I feel like that's yeah, I really loosened it. Yeah. You should try to roundhouse its head off. <clears throat> That's what I'd do, but I mean, I guess I won't tell With you what These to do. legs? <laughs> Are <laughs> yeah. you kidding me? Maybe an uppercut? Maybe uppercut the, its head off? The force off, that I don't you know. have if you hit with those legs, though. Uh, oh, that's be a lot. true. You could put it in an arm bar, rip its head off and its arms off. Rip it to pieces. Mm. 
Try, you should honestly not kill it and let it kill Cherry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go for like some sort of like uppercut punch on the spinal column, sure expose neck what? part. Yeah, upper uppercut on the spine. <laughs> yeah. Give me a roll. That's, is that you said it was just hanging? Wouldn't on you by just the glide yeah, up yeah. the spine with the uppercut? Wait, no, yeah, no, no, why no, not no. Just like, cut the threads <laughs> off. Cut the thread because I don't have like a I don't have like a knife or anything. Oh, I thought you had like little you sharp hands. Yeah, yeah, I, I got like a yeah, but I mean like that's still if you have like a fist scyther. weapon, that's like an uppercut, right? I don't yeah. know. Yeah, I thought you had little scyther I'm, blade arms, is what you yeah, said. Yeah, I'm like way. I'm hitting them with those. All right, I'm. A... <laughs> okay. Well, that's not really an uppercut. That's more like nineteen. A stab. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, plus you, whatever. You slice the hell out of it. Okay. What is he slicing or punching? I'm pun. It doesn't matter at this point. The point is the fucking bear's dead. What? Describe how you cut it then. Oh well. Yeah, oh yeah. Cool, well, okay. Since, really since, we're, yeah, since we're doing. Okay. Well, by the way, Chester gives me insane flexibility. I forgot to mention that, guys. And so I start off in a split. It does not seem like a it. Perfect <laughs> split. <laughs> and I come up out of the split with my scyther hands. And full ass decapitated. I can't really wave my arms in the the flourishing way that I want to because you know the helmet. But um, imagine a guy just doing some really cool shit with a highlight scoop, and that's one of my arms. Uh -oh. Can I say a line? Yeah, <laughs> from my tree. This is for this is a bilingual. We're going bilingual with our puns oh, now. Shit. I go, oh boy, that was oh so sweet. <laughs> Because Oso is bear in Spanish. Oh my god! So just like awesome line. Do we do high fives? You? I, oh shit! There's Spanish in this world. No, <laughs> oh my god! You know what that means? Oh my guy's really racist. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Yeah. Greenville's greatest enemy. <laughs> there he goes, tunneling. Seems so inclusive. <laughs> the natural enemy of the god. My, my darkest, my darkest character secret. Incredibly yeah. xenophobic, and well, that's that's what caused the avalanche was all that cartel, yeah. like uh, the the mine shafts and shit. So they could smuggle drugs in. They they caused an avalanche, wiped out. Your Even people. though we are drug growers <laughs> and we are tunnelers, we well, it was devaluing the market. Yeah, no, I I say it's so so sweet in an endearing way. Oh, okay. I learned this in my, my semester abroad. <laughs> the body of the fungal bear shudders as it hears, oh so sweet, and the final blow is delivered by Q. It stumbles a moment more, the grip on its mind releasing as a momentary look of sadness and confusion begin to spread across its face. It moans in pain, struggling a second longer to hold up its body before giving in to its own mass, collapsing with the weight of a falling tree. The ground shakes as dust and spore plume, spores plume around its dying frame. You gotta, you gotta roll, oh, roll there. You guys are fine. Jerry That's why I'm in a tree. Oh, oh, I, I, I can't hear, I can't hear roll. dude, you can't take I, much. I, 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 this this fight is shot unbearable. with radiation. Oh no. Yeah. You're gonna turn into like Dr. Manhattan. I got a fucking nine again. <laughs> it's my dice rolling. What's going on here? Wait, 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 that is what? like your fifth nine. <laughs> I can't stop getting them. Oh my um, lord. So we'll say this is acrobatics. <laughs> yeah, what, why, do I even have Thir acrobatics? 13. <laughs> Mine's, oh, Jesus, um, yeah, 13. Neither of you seem acrobatic at all. Yeah, I have like one health. I should be like... <gasps> I mean, you can't even... And now you do a triple back flip <laughs> yeah. in <the> spring. <laughs> I've been saving my life. Well, in his case, acrobatics is going to amount to him rolling pushing himself out of the way with those long arms to fall the opposite. <laughs> Hold his breath. Crawling. Most acrobatic crawling. Yeah, I think that's a 13 seen. for a hue. An 11 plus 2, right? Mm-hmm. All right, so you're both just barely uh, able to get out of the way. Uh, that was so funny. Probably shoving <laughs> each other maliciously, and the shove is able to put you out of the way of the plume of spores. Did Breen make it? Yeah. We just got a bear down and <laughs> Yes, he did. Okay. He made it. Breen, okay. who just hit himself with his Breen. shillelagh. <laughs> That kind of dust oh, himself off. He's such a bum. What the hell is a shillelagh? I'm uncultured. It's, I don't it's know like what I'm too way, embarrassed at. It's a shillelagh. stick with like a knot on the end, the Irish. Okay, you know. yeah. Oh. Okay, so like a druid stick. Yeah, that is know, like, yeah. I didn't know. I thought that was just like a cane or something. 
Uh, I thought it was those little guitars Hawaiians play. <laughs> yeah, at first I thought, it, yeah, I thought originally it was like a little instrument. <laughs> they whipped out and started banging. Uh, are you guys ready to go to Mount LT? The trail is <laughs> only know. a few hours from here. But without not a guide, a good even under right the now, best man. conditions, <laughs> it, would, it would take someone unfamiliar <laughs> to do it days to reach the top with all these mushroom creatures. You it would take even like... longer. And that's assuming the plan snatcher beasts haven't been equally agitated. <laughs> I mean, they don't call them plan snatchers for nothing. So even with the best laid plans, all it takes is one to snatch them up and ruin <laughs> things. You got like healing berries or something. I, wait, like. I'll, 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 I can heal you. Green is on the floor on his stomach and he starts striking into the <laughs> dirt in a tantrumous fit of rage. I can't go on with this. I can't go on with this. I'm a druid. I love this forest. My forest. He groans, bashing the earth with his bare feet and fists a moment more before turning and facing the party. I still have that map and know the way to the top. I can take you there. But in exchange, I ask that when the time comes, <laughs> you help me take out the great druid. Um, yeah. I just respond with Wait, fucking. I'm still in the tree. I, yeah, I respond with death uh, rattles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not well. healing word. I want to use healing <laughs> word on Jerry from my tree. And I give him one little thumbs up. I give him just, oh, wait. Thank you. I don't know. What's a cool healing word to use? And when I let me think of a pun for a guy that's in a tree. Um, hang in there. <laughs> you can say something about extending a branch of yeah, a branch uh, of life. Yeah. It's an olive tree. Oh, How wow. convenient! Yeah. <laughs> extend this olive branch. Hang in there. Bear down. <laughs> and I, it's a six. I heal you for six. That's ha that's more than shit half like my that. Health, I'm baby. just gonna press the button on because it's like one d four plus three. Like there's no point pulling out the cam. Like. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you got a six. Oh, it's babe. Yeah, that definitely helps feel a lot better. And uh, I, I look like at the half, green guy, and I better. go, like, I can't talk for the whole group, and they're kind uh. of, they're doing something over there, so. I'm not going to say yes. Uh, if it was up to me, though, you would definitely come with us, so, like, don't. Do you want to learn about the <laughs> plan snatchers? Is that what you're telling me? Because I can tell you about the plan snatchers. Pipe down, not, and I do a backflip <laughs> off the tree. Not and quite. I, you gotta wait for everybody else to get over here, and then you have this map coming. I made. It'll take you straight to the top. What? I can't hear you from up here. You're gonna have to repeat everything you're saying I until I get there. They tried to kill Nell. They want to break my heart. Oh, hey, you watch this. I'm gonna try to run off the branch and do a backflip into the ground. <laughs> like I, I don't, I. <laughs> I run straight until the branch can't support my weight, and then I do a backflip. You do like you spring try off an of angel it landing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What do I have to roll for that? Acrobatics, to, Acrobatics okay. or performance? Ac Honestly, that's I wish I had like living. okay, performance. Fuck yeah, I can do performance. Yeah. I need more excuses to persuade or perform. Okay. Why do, why? That is a one. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, and Bob breaks his neck. So, <laughs> so a one is I definitely a critical failure. Uh, oh my! The tree can't support my weight. <laughs> I think one. Can I describe my own ones, yes, or do you no, want to? I want I you to. You. Okay. I try. I'm like, watch this. <laughs> and as soon as I stand up the, and take one step, the branch falls. And I go, oh, 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 and I hit four more branches <laughs> on the way down. And I kind of like staircase, like slinky fall down it until I just splat on my uh, on my back, so I don't crush Baby Duke. Uh, and, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> and I cough up a little bit of blood. And you take you take five points of damage. Oh my okay. god, Jerry, help! help me. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck, that's rough. Help me like I helped you. Oh uh, shit! You, you, you feel the focus mushrooms wearing off. To an exhaustion begins to <laughs> set in on you, baby dude. Uh, uh, <laughs> probably I, that probably contributed. It probably did. I'm checking my bag for you, my homie, but I got I got some goblin gas. I got uh okay. I got I got water. Uh, I got water. It's fine. It's uh, fine. I turn over. I get my hands <laughs> and knees. So I'm just kind of like, oh, oh. Oh, and then I stand up and I kind of hobble over. What was going on? What's the plan? I should have given my help back. Oh, oh, fuck. 
sorry. <laughs> sorry, I'm late. What's going on? I'm, I'm back. I'm so back. Ooh. Is he okay? Are we going to the top of the mountain still? <laughs> oh, he's a tough guy. Look at the pegs, dude. A little more blood comes shooting out of my mouth. He probably didn't even feel it. Oh my god, I pull out a molar. <laughs> oh fuck. No, no, no. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Yeah, okay, good. Uh what's happening? <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> I'm massively, massively brain damaged. <laughs> oh, I right. turn around, there's a stick out of the back of my head. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Do you guys, uh, you want this map or you want me to show you the way to the what? top? <laughs> You're going to show me a way to get top? Yeah. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> what was, what are you guys thinking? Um... <clears throat> Hold on, let me sit up here. Wait, he wants us to kill the great alchemist or the great druid. The great druid. Oh. But why does Nell? I know you already said <laughs> I'm fully back. I, to brain I couldn't matter. tell her the truth. I couldn't tell her that I was part of a secret society of druids. And I was worried they would try to assassinate her, but it looks like they already. Did no, anyway. well, no, 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 no. This is something else. Yeah, that's yeah, like, yeah, that's like this. The, it's, it's probably not, all tied together. You're schizophrenic. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. let's get one thing straight. I didn't that's want to break possible. it to you when it was just me and you because I didn't want you to like attack me or yeah. anything. But brain. Let me guess. You've typed out some pa or you've written some notes yeah, lately. Like of uh, yeah, what do you, you got? Like a dossier or some shit. Uh, Shadows of doubt changed him. Yeah, <laughs> he's a crazy note taker. Yeah, I knew a schizophrenic guy once, red, dude. I, this guy's definitely. All over. He's been writing things and then eating them. I know. Let me see in your belly. Have you been eating paper? Let me see your tongue. Does he show me his tongue? I want to see his tongue. <laughs> talking about Breen? He, he, shows, about you, he yeah. shows you its yeah, tongue. It looks pretty dry. Okay. Is there any paper cuts? Do you have any healing paper. salves? Any fucking like yeah, things of the forest yeah. that can help us? Or no, off, this you know? guy's like, fucking. What does he do? Been, I've off. been I don't living in this <laughs> yeah, in the brain machine for the past two days, eating jarred tuna and yeast. Yeast. Oh, you went to yeast. So you are eating yeast. Well, you I lied went earlier. To give it to the great druid as an offering, but I've had to eat it since. Oh a, my a god! Fake what does offering. that taste like on its own? It's palatable. <clears throat> okay. It tastes like shit. At worse, Jerry would know. Oh. Yeah. Shit or yeast? <laughs> I mean, you, know. you know what shit tastes like, Jerry. <laughs> you don't know my uh, life. This was just dunking on you. <laughs> yeah. And Jerry's very experienced with what dick and shit tastes like. <sighs> um, yeah, I'm not completely sold on taking out the Great Druid. If I'm being honest, because we got uh, Chip and Chunk to look after a little. And others, I'm and also, you, he's the root of the issue. Can you hold what, off? Do you on know what Nell? Like she needed some sort of. Have you heard of the? This is personal for me a little bit. The Lord of the Storm uh, music sheet. Can I show it? Queen. Yeah, I'm you familiar. This? Nell's been trying to play that song for years. She mentioned like me getting something for her and. Then she I, she would teach me a way to do this all the time instead of a one time use. Spores you know from the was? great druid. Ugh. Oh shit! I mean, yeah, I don't yeah. really want to kill him. Well, I mean, I figure that's the only way we'll be able to take him. What does that mean? His spores? Uh, he has the the cure, a counter spore. Oh, and if you and kill he's him, the bad guy. Well, he's linked to it all. Okay, mm -hmm. it's all connected. He's the one who started it, and if we kill him, there will be nothing to control them. I mean, have you ever met this guy before, or is he like a... No. Oh, okay. So Why, you're, you you're just assuming your mind. he's yeah. like an asshole. Because you, you went... I, I thought you were going up there to talk heard. to him, to give him tribute. Well, that's what I had to tell now. <laughs> you heard. Oh. Is there poopy on your face? No. <laughs> that looks like poopy. Right, yeah, it looks a little like poopy, check. but <laughs> I know yeah, shit smells like buddy. Can I do it? Can I do a smell check? Can I do a smell yeah, check? When, no, when you do it, I use the prestidiation to add a little bit of poop smell to his cheeks. 
<laughs> no, it's going to smell like poop. It's Six. definitely going to. Yeah, it definitely, it I, definitely but, smells like poop. Well, Ew, look right there. He smelled it. Smells like, why would you lie about that? Why would yeah. you lie to us? That Even definitely if smells worse. like shit. <laughs> if you're willing to lie about something as simple as shit in your face. face. Yeah. How'd you get, how'd it get, is it yours? This isn't it mine. It, it's it's not, probably dirt. It's, I was under the wagon. Worse. Waiting for my moment. Mm. Um, yeah, I, I, I would say wouldn't. you could totally lead us to the, the great uh, druid or whatever, but um three is kind of a crowd could you like walk ahead of us like 10 feet of like, course i will lead guide us? you yeah guide us from a distance and should we check this bear's pockets and see if it's got any loot or anything maybe yeah was it wearing like a little vest or anything it is it if i gra if i were to <laughs> eat its heart there i gain a property <laughs> take Body parts from it if you wanted to. You're not sure what the property is. Oh, doing. dude, can a I skin it like Red Dead Redemption? Yeah, cape would be I dope. I think it's pelt. But I'm also wearing so many clothes. The, one duster and one pair of sweatpants. I want to take some. Uh, would cover you in spores, but for JB, that wouldn't affect his condition uh, really oh, any. It. I don't want him to have that around me, <laughs> though. Even more spores. A little cape. Could, could I get yeah. a? Can I get a bear claw? Like a like the just the the claws. <laughs> the dumb. Mm, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, mm. yeah, you could grab one. Uh, Okay. Yeah, I might get like I wanna like three is of its them. Dick covered in mushrooms or no? Is it relatively clean? It's yeah, I've heard they're covered in them, but it's got a very the idea like, that ability. unless unless it was yeah, virility. You tried to beat it, kind of like getting dust out of a rug. They aren't gonna. Pop. I'm not gonna beat its dick, dude. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, it's not for either. perverted if reason. It's for virility or something, and somebody hit you, it would probably react. Oh. oh, you can make a shield and put that on the front of it, and people hit it. Shield. They get the spores. Did we skin them though? Is that that happened? I mean, I think you're deciding how to chop it up right we're now. Just, yeah, we're yeah, talking yeah, right yeah. now, and I'm thinking gonna, if anyone doesn't want it in particular, I could be the one. That I could take its. It's about virility. It's about a T. Mm, you can cut the cock off. I'd be the interested in taking the penis. Okay. You, yes. uh, okay. If there's no objections, yeah. Personally, I don't think I need it, but. JB, do you? It's not for me. Do you want we, the bear, you, the bear penis? No, I'll give you. I tell you what, because you really you've had that eye on that penis since we even started fighting. I'll let yeah. you have it, Bob, as long as Before. you lend me a dagger to skin him. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, uh, baby, do give it, him a dagger. Uh, that's good. But don't touch him. Toss it. <laughs> and also, when you're done with that dagger, wipe it off. Burn it. All right. <laughs> <laughs> You are your bait. You're I, one step from being a leper. We know you're on a time. Yeah, okay, yeah. we've got like you don't have long. Baby Duke successfully tosses you the dagger. One of them. But babe, thanks, babe. Don't give them both in case you got to cut them down eventually. Have you, been, have you been eating yeast? I'm guessing while you're walking and doing all this stuff, JB. Uh, he isn't. Uh, Did, uh, if I had yeast, I've been <laughs> chugging it. I think I ate it as soon as. Uh, I mean, you have a whole keg nice. of it strapped to Wonder Boy. Oh, then fuck yeah, I've been eating yeast. Why the hell wouldn't I? I just make sure. Um, I don't know, maybe I, you don't want to. So I take the penis. Okay, Bob, you, have, you want the penis? Yeah, it's not like a weird... No, 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 no I was just saying. Oh, you have the penis, then have the yeah, fungal it's bear. it's not like a weird thing. Absolutely. Listen, I'm just very curious. Three of the bear paws, bear claws? I, yeah, no, 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 not, not three. I want as many as I can have. Of like just the the claw. Like, well, there'd like be three. max of four, four, right? Yeah, that's four. And you How could take no, no, not the entire paw, <laughs> just the finger, like the fing like the claw parts. I don't know. It looks the, like in your little image. There's four. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, four per four. each hand. Yeah, that's four per hand. Yeah, sixteen. Oh, the claws. I see. Yeah. Like the finger parts. Just the finger claws. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Okay. What are you gonna do with those? I'm going to. Have you ever seen Jeepers Creepers? He makes yeah, those shurikens uh, out of claws. Long. I'm going to take three of them, and I'm going to twine them together and make shurikens. That's pretty cool. That is pretty dope. Thanks. Now I wish I... Do you think I could turn this into <laughs> some sort of weapon? <laughs> you could, uh, penis, you could, wrap, okay. you could probably Fair wrap pack? you know, the boomerang with Het and have it like yeah. half bludgeoning damage or something. Well, it's going to be for good Varilla tea. Okay, it's yeah. a tea you can make. Oh, okay. That's you just dip a little cock in it. For virility. 
<laughs> we no we have is. so many sex related items, and there has been no pussy gotten on this entire show. Yeah. Well, you never <laughs> know. Well, we do <laughs> find an I have ass oh poppers. God. I got I'm boner go up <laughs> pills. I got Listen, boner go down pills, and I haven't I'm needed any of this shit. This, this, these per persuasion uh, modifiers. Okay, well, I once mean, once it comes along, it's gonna be like persuasive. when you're really over leveled in an RPG, and then you accidentally stumble into a place you should have gone long ago. You're, you're oh, just gonna yeah, crush it. Perfect. It'll be fine. We are just yeah. gonna be fucking bitches left and right. Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, we've all had sex. <laughs> oh yeah. And all I right, let's go. All you can talk about. <laughs> all right. What do you What do you take? You took the pelt, JB. Yeah, yeah. I skinned it. Like, yeah, really right. cool guy. Uh, actually, let me write this down. Otherwise, can I, I like how? Oh, shit, dude. Do I have anything to attach it to the shield right now? Because that sounds like a dope meme. It seems to have some a little bit of glue in it. Yeah, is it glue? Some, somebody has some sort of adhesive. It's got I'm pretty penis sure. Penis glue. I thought Hugh did. Yeah, I'd rather eat my own shit right now than talk to Hugh. All right, I, I was about to die. say, come yeah, fucking yeah, come yeah. back, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> I, I, Bizzle said that he's like, I think somebody does have an adhesive. I wasn't saying shit. <laughs> <laughs> Tight lift. Like, yeah. yeah, and then oh, in silence, and he guy. was like, okay, he's not gonna help out me out. All right, oh, I think it's Sam. <laughs> Yeah. Nope. <laughs> I, am, I, I I need to cool off from him. All right. I'm not even looking in his direction right now. I got you. Okay. I got you. Uh, all right. And so, <laughs> this thieves tools. Is there is there glue in that? Yeah, I got the gluiest yeah, glue too, man. You come. It's come like back super adhesive. We're always talking about thieves having sticky fingers. So <laughs> yeah, I assume I, they use a lot of glue. <laughs> oh my. We got like a hammer and nails, like something. Come on. <laughs> I, not to like take it off track oh, again, but when we start walking, I have a thing I want to do. All right. Well, you're gonna, you're about to start walking because Breen okay. hands you map. Okay, Breen in the front, and then why don't Jerry and Hugh, you guys take the the middle, and uh, Wonder Boy and I will take the back. You know, we'll fall into formation. Okay. Yep. <laughs> no, no nothing weird about it. I do. I like animals. Yeah, I like walking uh, I, in, uh, in the particular order that middle. you tell me to. Yeah. Okay. Well, then that works. Keep one and I, arms distance. And away I'm from very me. perceptive, and that guy up there is probably perceptive. So you guys will be safe in the middle. Okay. And it'll be good, you know, to keep you two because you're both falling to the dark side together. Yeah. And uh okay, and we're now walking. All right. And I'm now back here with Wonder Boy. The I'm going to oh, go ahead. Sorry. I'm going to listen to you. No, no, I'm not listening to you. I'm going to cast Speak with Animals, a spell that I have not used yet and have had for a long time. Uh or maybe I have used it on a spider or some and I, yeah, get ready for a mega voice for this creature. <laughs> I heard for, the for backstory. Give, for, <laughs> yeah, for it. No. Well, Forgive me for their personality. Mm. Okay, so I want to cast it and be like, hey. And Wonder, Wonder, Boy, Wonder Boy. Oh, he's talking Wonder to Wonder Boy? ear perks up towards you. And then you see him give a scoffing look. <laughs> as though, pff, not talking to you. And he, hey. he turns his head away. <laughs> oh, sorry. Hey's for horses. You're a donkey. <laughs> My bad. Hello. Is what I didn't say. Does he like that kind of humor? Or? And he looks back at you and says, what? A goblin, huh? And then looks back oh. forward. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you get the idea that Wonder Boy has a problem with goblins for some reason. Okay, will you pick this up from your owner? <laughs> yeah. Hey, so you what if I did, huh? Oh, my so what God. if I did, huh? That is rich. You would have a You're problem with that. You're walking around with a little alien. You would man. have a problem okay. with that. Okay, dude, real. Listen, you can go back to silence forever, man. I just wanted to chat. Hey, JB talks to me. He talks to me when it counts, okay? We understand That's each other on a different level. That's actually what I wanted level. to get into. Love that what guy. What do you guys talk about? Talk about everything, man. You know, JB's told to me you? everything. Of course, he's good to me. He's great to me. That little miss you know out the stables was no big deal. You saw how yeah. he gave up no. that stetso. No. He gave up a no. stetso for me. All right? You know. That man loves you me. You know, he didn't even want to He didn't <laughs> even want to get you from the JB. stables. Okay? Goblins he almost ruined my you. damn life. So, if you'll excuse me, 
Oh, you think all goblins are the same? I'm just saying I'd rather talk to nobody than you. That's gobbledygook, dude. We are. Okay, that's kind of un- funny. I like that. <laughs> we are all unique individuals that's not what with JB different. Said. Oh my god! What is even saying about goblins? <laughs> uh, nothing good. You know. You know. I'm like, what is he talking? Make fun of our height and our green skin? You know, I'm like five feet taller than the dude. I mean, basically, the way he's explained it is the world would be a better place <laughs> if it was goblin free. Jesus Christ. And he's been so good to me, you know, it it seems true. Why would he lie to me? You know? JB's told me okay, his deepest, man. darkest secrets. Like? At the root of it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not just going to tell any as- anybody off the street, let alone a goblin. All right? Okay. So forget about it. You know, I was so excited because, I, you know, you're... What a rarity you are. Purebred donkey, well, you know. Yeah, honestly, you seem like a rarity yourself. I've never seen a goblin of your stature. I wasn't really sure, except, uh, you know, he speaks the, so well the name goblin Pop too. Goblin seemed kind of evident. <laughs> we like to be direct. We like to uh, really spell it out for you because, yeah, growing up, you know, it's like I got bullied because I was so big and strong and so handsome compared to a lot of other goblins. So it's like it wasn't always easy. And you're you know, probably trying to easy. trick me with this relatability, huh? That story's no, probably not a farce. No, farce from it, okay? It's the truth. And I'm spitting it. And I like to spit truths. And I don't know, man. <laughs> he starts trying to get JB's attention. Wonder Boy emits a sound of distress. <laughs> Wonder Boy, what's wrong? Oh, you <laughs> never even talked to this thing. Oh, hey, JB, your donkey's on the fritz, dude. We might have to take it to a goddamn I, vet. I don't okay. know what's up with him, but he doesn't like goblins. I don't know. I don't know why. I, <laughs> any I, I any, give any away. In- inclination no, of I, us to why? I got to keep him away from them because he just he starts nipping at them. It's, it's, I don't know. I you know, can't uh, help it, right? It's how he's raised, I guess. JB told me that in goblins it, uh, eat my kind. <laughs> How long have you, uh, did you raise him? No, wait, you said you've only had him for like a month? Yeah, I had him for a month. You had I've this? had him for a month. We've been yeah. together Who's for years. before him? <laughs> you got a messed what? up <laughs> sense of time. Okay, man, well, I don't want to talk circles with a goddamn, you know, someone so small-minded. I'm not talking to you anymore, JB. Are you talking to the donkey? No. <laughs> what? What do you mean? no. I'm talking at him. Well, All right. Uh, I may be small minded, but at least I'm not big muscled. Okay. <laughs> Damn it. I told you I was sensitive <laughs> about my, my physique. Yeah, um, they're too big. Yeah. Well, maybe. I don't know. Maybe we'll chat again sometime. Maybe not. I'm not really sure what the, what the takeaway from this was. I was. I don't know what I wanted out of this. I got I got <laughs> I got to regroup. Yeah. Yeah, you do that. And then the okay, he, man. Wonder Boy nestles in next to JB frightened. Okay. Mm, good All donkey. Right, good I'll, boy. Good I'll, Wonder Boy. I'll keep the rear. And yeah, you And you, now I know that JB's a racist <laughs> towards my kind. Yeah. I whispered, and he's going crazy. I whispered and, him. I whispered him. He's like, he's one of the all right ones. All right, Wonder Boy. And I tap him. I tap him on the head. He's okay so God. far. Okay. Which is counter to everything you've ever told Wonder Boy up to that point. <laughs> the I haven't found, a, I haven't found the an board. angle on him kind yet. Of crumbling, but you, <laughs> he acknowledges you. It's clearly, okay. JB. That's he, actually good for, some for me. Reason Wonder Boy just. He's attached to JB. But now JB, the man he's attached to, told him that I'm one of the good ones. So yeah. I said one I of the all right that. ones. I haven't found a flaw yet. All right. I, you said great ones. One of the great okay, ones. Okay, keep them an arm's length. And, you know, I got long ass arms, so <laughs> yeah. be aware. Okay. All right. That's all I wanted. Nice. It's not really, I didn't get out of it what I wanted. <laughs> what? <That's> what I'm... <laughs> he thought he was going to be your so best I'm going to get some JB secrets or something. I didn't know there's got to be a goddamn a built-in security against me through prejudice. All right. All right. Now I just have to learn how to speak to animals, and I'm sure he'll... 
something. I'm sure he'd love you. Yeah, fucking another bigot. The trail is, much to your surprise, actually easier going with Breen helping lead the way. Paths that would have been obvious seem to part ways for him, and you begin to worry perhaps he is half as decent a druid as he thinks he is. The light of the three moons and your own torches is all there is to guide you, but Breen seems to have no difficulty in following the forest through excuse me, following the forest path through the maze of wood. Uh, you all three give me rolls. Shit, dude. Okay, I of what uh, let caliber? me just fucking preemptively guess uh nine. Perception or investigation? I got a fourteen actually, plus uh what? Perception? I got a plus three. I got a 13 oh, wait, is plus it investigation? Two, 15. 17. Investigation or perception. I got oh, 22. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, I got 17. I so see it all. I see everything. I see those. I see boots so in the you trees. see boots stuck up yeah. in the trees. And just oh, there, those floating shoes. You start noticing just the shoes or footwear of adventurers <laughs> are, are worn out and strung up in the higher branch. Oh. They're tied to telephone poles. Yeah. God. I thought they were just like standing up on a branch. I was like, there's an invisible man wearing boots up yeah. there. And <laughs> okay. he's naked. Green 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 notices <laughs> you staring and says, ah, yes, the plan snatchers, <laughs> pausing to tap his chin knowingly, his eyes narrow. You think, although it is a bit hard to tell, given that he always seems to be squinting as though in deep thought or deep constipation. Known for snatching up travelers who have laid even the best plans, the adolescents have a fondness for footwear, stringing them up like trophies among the higher branches of the forest that they dwell in. The adults tend to not waste time with such things, tearing off limbs in their entirety. Oh. Marching me along. I'm How? in the back. I'm going to tuck my arms into my trench coat, and then I'm going to cr cast two illusionary arms. Oh, nice. <laughs> ah, through the sleeve. Oh, that's clever. <laughs> no, you're behind us. No one's going to see that. <laughs> that's, that's, I, that's I know. I knew it for me, man. The one that's... who gets grabbed, you know? Yeah. I'm not. I, I heard him say they're gonna grab limbs whole, dude. I'm not ready yeah. for my robot arm arc yet. We don't have the technology. Uh, I'm getting there oh. slowly. With my yeah, you're slow. Yeah. You're not even a fucking person anymore. <laughs> with, my, with my science <laughs> tech, I am getting closer. You're, crazy. Not, you're not learning anything out there. You have no you're idea. You're not getting While smarter. While you slumber and sleep, I toil in the night, soldering, reading the same book welding. over and over. Mm. All sorts of stuff. Yeah. Hammering. Is there any way I can bring my arms into my like where my belly is, <laughs> and then and then just have Chester have like fake arms that stick down? <laughs> He's copy my like own suit beast. of armor. <laughs> no, just like like imagine you're wearing a suit of armor, but you also put your hands where your like belly is, <laughs> and then you just, give it a try. And then just keep the keep the sleeves, the Chester sleeves, hanging there with no arms in them. You could try. Okay, I want to try that. Oh, you... do I roll? Roll twenty. Okay. Dude, you're stuck in that suit. You're not moving out. Of, you're not. You're not moving those arms. Twenty. Oh fuck! Holy shit. I ate my words. Yeah. And you feel Chester trying to grip, and it's really hard for you to squeeze your arms out. And then all of a sudden, you hear a kind of. And you're able to pull them inside the bit of chest cavity you have, and it squeezes down oh, around dude. it. Oh, my God. You're not going to be able to move your arms Yeah, but, that. but that sounds like a future because problem. of an upcoming possible yeah. fight with the plane snatchers, and now that my arms are useless, and I, I kind of use them to cut my genitals. You know, like both of them. Yeah. Cut I feel your good. genitals? Cup. Cup them. He's yeah, cup. he's oh, going to cut like, his cock off. Dude. But it's yeah. like you're trying to do it inside of a wetsuit. You have no exactly. space to move. Oh. Okay. Uh... Well, the good thing is dick and balls are so tiny. Oh, dude, so. I have, like, fucking goddamn monkey arms. What the hell am I going to do? Uh, can I, like, wrap <laughs> them around my one. fucking body? <laughs> you better have one for you, yeah. dude. I'm going to, like, wrap them around me like a straight jacket. Yeah. I don't know. Like, I fucking, yeah, well, You guys are completely useless yeah. in this fight, dude. <laughs> so, oh, God. Okay. Straight jacket? That's actually probably be best. I can tie them in a big knot behind your back if you want. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of want to be able to just, you know, get out in case I have to fight. Climb. Uh, what climb. about uh, Breen? Have you ever seen someone get their arms snatched off? Like, what? How often do you travel this this way? Oh, I've definitely seen it happen before. Uh, like, the way like they lot, do it is or? they'll 
there's a cliff area on the way to the peak, and they like to lurk under the ledges inside of their little perches. That's mm. where they live, and they hang by one short arm and one long arm, uh, sometimes mimicking a vine or stalactite. And they wait for travelers to come by and grab them. And Is there another way up to it. the top of the mountain? It's definitely the best way. It sounds like honestly the worst way but well after the lake there is a closer cave that we could try but uh the map doesn't really show us what's inside there eh, well, okay maybe i know we that it leads up arm. but the other you know way what? Is i'm more actually direct. feeling pretty safe about the arm snatching people so yeah, yeah. just in the cave uh, there might be cock gobblers <laughs> yeah. Yeah. i've never yeah. been had by them the younger ones have stolen more boots than i've I can't lose uh, my I, boots. I can't even count. Yeah, well, I, I literally, literally cannot lose I've my I've got boots. my cowboy That's boots on, I think. <laughs> I stopped wearing if them on my sandals, feet If he loses his sandals, his fucking head's going to pop. It's going yeah. to get squeezed. Yeah. Not good. <laughs> yeah. That's are a, you still wearing your wingtips, or what are you? No, I'm wearing the boots that you see. <laughs> oh. Where's the wingtips? Those are good. Those are big targets. Yeah. <laughs> They're good. They're looking good. Are they part of Chester? Yeah. Or they, they, he's literally... How the fuck would they be... Taken off. They want to uh, check they might, his body. They might like rip my fucking leg off while they're going for it. I don't know. <laughs> Your feet. You, you can inspect yeah. you. Yeah, yeah, I'll inspect him. Yeah, 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 let me let me check go him ahead, out. Take a look. What do you want me, me to do? A, I, I'm posing give me like a an model. Investigate. <laughs> Stand just like Let's that. Do. Yeah, I'm doing a nice pose. Eighteen total. Ooh. And Jerry. Oh yeah, uh, I got a one. So I'm fucking. I might <laughs> something flew into my fucking eye. I think. Yeah, like, I, I, I you went to go look and poke yourself in the eye somehow. Got smacked in the head by a tree <laughs> while I was fucking looking at it. Yeah, you're <laughs> convinced. You're convinced that he was fine, and he probably just has the wingtips on underneath his suit or something like that. Oh, that's perfect. You're just to the point of being argumentative about it. You are convinced. Oh. Uh, Bob, I'm however, so sorry. What's up? Okay, you're about to tell me. Okay, so I got a text right then that like it took my entire brain away <laughs> from was, uh, what you were saying. No, no, <laughs> you got an 18, and yeah. you realize it's been a while since you saw those wingtips, and you start scanning around you, and you <laughs> hear a faint kind of sizzling sound and almost a smoldering from his back, and you go <laughs> to look at it, and his pack is somewhat covering it, but you think you see. <laughs> what remains of the wingtip shoes they appear to have melted part way away uh, which oh, might account God. for the more recent change in Hugh's personality he's you know he's always kind of been a, a smart ass in his own he's way he's never been good he's never it's been almost good. as though he's been especially uh, <laughs> as of late so the wingtips that control ear. Chester, isn't there just one on him? Or am I two? There's two, two on his back. Two on him. He's wearing them like little wings. Okay, I forgot that. And they're sizzling off. Yeah. <laughs> you gonna give him a warning? Does he even care? Yeah. Like, does he? Give uh, it? yeah. I don't even know. I don't even know. <laughs> I don't even know how it started. This is me thinking as <laughs> Pop. Like, I noticed this, and I'm like. Well, I know for sure Jerry's like pretty much gonna go insane and die because he's been <laughs> exposed like four times to the like One the thing we're not supposed to time, touch, man. and he's got that glove that makes him go feral. Now Hugh is like certainly going to be corrupted by this creature that he's so uh, like it was his fault because he wanted to wear it so bad. Well, look at me, but I look like good. no, Come no, on. I'm not talking to you. <laughs> this is my internal monologue. I'm like, and like. Chester was for everyone, and he like totally took him to himself, and now he wears him like a suit of armor. He used to like carry us all around, and like he kind of has what's coming towards him. But I'm not going to be able to like fight both of them, you know. For, like I started slowing my pace a little bit, and I like turn around, I look at the trail behind me, I'm like, oh, fuck. I could go home. <laughs> I could go to I could go to Kurtz. I could help him franchise. And as you do that, Breen says, so that's why I stopped wearing things on my feet altogether. And he turns and he raises a leg with impressive dexterity, pointing and wiggling his toes at you before lowering it back to the ground. 
JB and Hugh, you feel yourself begin to buzz, a sensation you haven't felt since back in Spider Lord Ozai's headspace, and you pat your pockets to find the source. A moment later, you're able to locate it, and it appears to be coming from the single-use slips of memory foam given to you by Declan Lovely. Nice. Uh, oh. Okay, that, was good. that really helps because I was like, who the this fuck guy, is Declan? Yeah, so yeah. Not quite Spider Lord voice because it, it goes looks like... a little deeper. <laughs> ah, yes. <clears throat> and JB, you read yours first. Mr. Bezos, I hope all is well with you. I don't have much space here, so I'll keep it short. That fingerless leather glove of yours is from a wrestler of yesteryear known as the Blue Angel. He was a fairly prominent fighter in his day, but that day itself was years ago. Either they've faded into obscurity or been dead, but there hasn't been any word on them in ages. Apparently the flame itself can handle heat much like an oven mitt by itself, but when active can hold any flame without being burnt. You have to be careful though, as it only works when the glove or the area the glove covers. So even if it's a fine fashion choice, the fingerless part seems a, a bit of a design flaw if you're going to go about dipping your hand into molten metals or things of that nature. It also appears to be imbued with something, perhaps a bit of the old wrestler's personality, sunk into them after years of use. I'd be careful with that, but you're probably already aware, and if you've ever activated it before, which by the way can be done by touching any bit of blood. And then Hugh. Fuck, you better not figure any girls. Me wrestling memorabilia, and I didn't know. I already knew yeah. that. Hugh. Oh, cool. Yeah, I already knew all that stuff because uh, I dipped my and hand in the And you didn't share with fucking anyone. <laughs> it was just earlier. I don't know. Like, this, ah. this episode. <laughs> I admit I was eavesdropping when I found out, but thanks for letting me know, even if unintentionally, that I could be charging Attila a lot more for these vials of acid. <laughs> I can't believe she's actually been paying so much. If you're ever back in town, I'll be sure to give you a discount. Ooh, Something sure had her shaken, but I shouldn't be wasting space telling you that. Anyway, back to your bow, which was something of a surprise. Not too many longbow, longsword combos that I've seen running around, and I was able to find some older texts related to such a thing. They say it extends from an, an old religion of the deep and is tied into something called the Crophecy. What you wield is probably just a knockoff. Relig religious nuts love shoving their symbology down other people's throats, even more so if it has a pointy end at its tip and a crusader on its hilt. It was written that whoever was the true owner would be destined to be the prophet of their time, capable of not only drawing its immense, <laughs> immense weight with ease, but that they could impart their emotion into its shots. Unlike the crybaby's bow, which can only shoot sadness into its victims, the crawdad's cry can be fueled to fire by anger, happiness, sadness, and possibly more. The notes I found were rather apocryphal, but you may be able to ask the great druid for more information on where to find out more. Supposedly, they've been around nearly as long as the woods themselves here at the Demuba Triangle, and should be able to send you in the right direction. Uh. And I, and didn't, I don't have a notepad, so yeah. I'm going to get no writing. Wait, so I, I can't, like, write anything back to him? Like, <laughs> yeah, can we write? We can, right? He'll see yeah, it. Yeah, it's single use, so you, what, you'll be able to get... You can reply, but that'll be the end of transmission. Oh, okay. You each get um, one use. <laughs> Make it count. Uh, Thanks. What, what are you, you going to write, JB? What am I writing? Yeah. Uh, I already knew this shit. I want a fucking yeah. refund, dumbass, dude. <laughs> I felt it. <laughs> yeah, thanks for nothing. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, thanks, Captain. Fucking obvious. Your mother. <laughs> and I spit right in the fucking onto the paper, and then it just like kind of forms on his head. <laughs> uh, I'm oh, gonna draw man. a little caricature of of uh, Declan with my pencil. A little dick butt. Yeah. Just like uh, you know, just a little stick figure. A little heart Declan? over the eye. Does that have oh, a heart? Yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah. A little heart over the eye. Uh, yeah, and then yeah. Also, just like, and then I'm gonna draw a stick figure of me, and we're holding hands. It's probably as best as you can draw. You're just calling it a yeah, stick just like a stick figure, cause... like the most pathetic yeah. stick figure. I don't spend any time. I love time you, Dequin. Yeah. <laughs> and it's us like I it's, it's like a pic of me and him <laughs> high fiving or something. And as you're writing your replies back to them, Richter Kane, I'm guessing, is in the middle of you guys. Yeah, and, he's like cattle. Bob is in the back. Yeah. And 
Baby Duke starts to stir and then all of a sudden is very alarmed and jolts against your body. And Baby like Duke spider sense. looks at the cloak wrapped around them and looks at the body of Richter Kane and looks at the cloak. Papa, I, yes. I recognize this. Like what? recalling something from a distant dream. I, I remember myself wearing all black, watching this this man in a wrestling match. What? I, I, something some shady deals, <laughs> dark visions. Oh, baby Duke in black. I don't know <laughs> if I if I was a Is manager or what, but I remember uh, seeing somebody fight this man in a wrestling ring. And I was part of it somehow. What, what man? Who won? Yeah, who won? Who's I don't next? remember. I don't remember. Uh, were you wearing a little outfit like this, but black? It was something That's similar. Adorable. Little tuxedo. That's, like spy versus spy. And were you happy? No. Good. So you're happier now with me. I, I was greedy. I don't know. It's, it's all just... Whoa. That's one of the fifty cents. Where, I hate. Green. Where did you get these? This guy. Uh, he's kind of an asshole. He's he was at the bar because he is. Oh, Can we not uh, hear any of this? Is that, are they having his a brother? They were having a AB conversation. His brother is. What he says is evil. People say he's evil. They're in some sort of immortal bout, okay? Because they can like regenerate. Mm. All right, I mean, you look, you see he's headless, and his okay. brother is apparently in that little box on his hip. I mean, I think that's why I didn't recognize him for so long. Is maybe you know the head would have helped. The headless aspect. Yeah. Really yeah. Imagine it. a guy that's old. Oh God. Under there. <laughs> yeah. It must and be he's him. ugly. Yeah. <laughs> and he. Is also, I'm trying to remember any other attribute about the guy. He's, there's a word you kept using. He's so like, sinewy. That sinewy, <laughs> yes. He's sinewy. That's exactly what yeah, it is. That's the first word that came to my mind when I recognized he, this beef jerky he's, like Bobby. Yeah, he's very sinewy. Well, I, what? I can't seem to remember anything else right now other than I swear I was connected to this man. I think he rigged a match I was part part of or managing part of. I can't That's remember. Very interesting. So you were or maybe I rigged the match. But no, you I You were a have. real person in this world at one point. I, this is the first memories I've had, Pava, so I I don't know. Well, to keep shoving those down cuz Okay. Then what if you got parents and they try to take you, okay? No, don't no, think about no. stuff well, like I, that. I too don't much. think I would count as the <laughs> other think. me. There should be two of me if anything and they can go deal with my parents. Well, my family's right here. Okay. What do you mean there should be two of you? Are there two of me? I don't know. You you said that I came. What do you reveal? <laughs> you said I came from the 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 loot in Spider Lord from the Ozai's the lair. My body world, wasn't, yeah. wasn't tethered loop. up. So I don't. Maybe there are two of you. That would be interesting. A little spy versus spy, all white, all black. Okay. Well, that's good. Actually, do do tell if you if you have more I revelations. I will. Okay. Well, back to bed now. <laughs> you've been doing a lot of this. Is the most thinking you've done in a long time. You need to rest. I don't want you getting a tummy ache. Yep. Oh my God! Look at that. <laughs> There's some <laughs> shit. So he rips off Jerry's arms. <laughs> I, I couldn't pay attention. I couldn't watch from the rear because I was distracted. A thousand enemies blew past me <laughs> and they're ravaging he my party. These, like, insanely <laughs> private conversations with like donkeys and fucking. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, then, you're crazy, dude. You're a crazy person. And so I, why don't you, you talk know, to us? And then it just does because SpongeBob close up of me and <laughs> me and JB. JB sizzling and smoking. I've, I've got steam coming this, out of my face. This racist donkey and this little old baby are the two most normal things in my <laughs> life right in now. The background, like Neil Breen's just like talking about how awesome he is. <laughs> yeah. And Breen manages I, to continue to talk yeah. nearly the entire time. I just time. got that. Okay. <laughs> and yet says almost nothing of importance you have a feeling that as, as obnoxious as it might be the monotonous nature of his speech may actually be keeping worse creatures at bay 
You feel as though something has been watching you, following your footsteps through the forest. But then again, it isn't so strange to feel stared at when walking through an unknown section of woods at night. Especially not after having an enormous fungus-covered bear come swooping in to attack you earlier in the evening. With your heads on a swivel, you continue to check your sides, behind you and above you. Occasionally you hear the rustling and hooting of birds moving about, or see another pair of tattered shoes or boots strung above, glowing in the moonlights. But otherwise, see no indication of any larger life forms. Eventually, the trees begin to thin out, and you find yourselves walking up steeper and steeper slopes, to the peak of Mount Elty, or excuse me, the peak of Mount Elty now remains almost constantly within sight, growing larger and larger with every step. You swear it could only be a few minutes more away, but then a few minutes more pass, and it only grows larger, not closer, piercing further into the night sky. The lake, Hammertooth Lake, isn't far now, Breen says, glancing back towards the party. We can stop there for the rest of the night if you'd like, and be fresh for the final leg up to the peak. And it does indeed seem like a good idea. The focus of the blue and silver mushrooms have worn off for Pob and Baby Duke, and exhaustion has set in. Putting one foot in front of the other has become more and more taxing, like your legs are filling with lead, and you feel a cloudiness fogging your thoughts where clarity once was. Not an hour later, the woodline begins to spread on either side of you, and the thinning treetops give way to a large and shimmering scene, a beautiful alpine lake coated in the dancing light of the three moons, ripples in defiance towards the dark sun above. A calm, cool feeling invites you to its edges, lined with long grass, and it appears a fine place to set up camp until dawn. In the distance, you spot the remains of a small orange tent that has been worn away to nearly nothing by time, but otherwise see no signs of civilization. Um, yes, we just make camp here. I said it. <laughs> I say this is take a, a great pill. spot for camp. <clears throat> this is an awesome spot. Before we do any sort of like resting and all that, like. Of course. Up stuff. Can we? Can, can I please go pee? Yeah, of course. I gotta blow. You, well, yeah, let's have some time to just chat. <laughs> do you mean in real life? Yes, I had to pee real bad. And, and I, and I just game. need to take this helmet off. It's like clamping my head. <laughs> All right. I also have right. to piss really bad. Okay, I need we'll, a banana. we'll reconvene in four minutes. I already pissed earlier, so I'm good. Now I'll get a drink. You yeah, give it to me. Oh my god, it's almost 12. Oh, that's probably because I came Hey. Alright, I'm back Hello. and rejuvenated. Hello. Yeah, I got a drink. I also peed a tiny bit, about two, three millimeters. millimeters. Mm. I got some monster munch. It's some sort of pickled onion potato chip that someone sent me. It looks gross as hell. <laughs> Allergies are kicking my ass. <clears throat> Playing golf was like a, it was a mistake. It's double edged. I haven't left the house in so long. So I don't want to sneeze out my blood clots. Or my, yeah, um, that sucks. I'm thinking about now. I'm gonna give me like. Sorry. Oh. Oh my god. There we go. Yeah, it's good though. All right. I'm sorry. I'm ready. You're good. Um, Alright, so you're, you're at the shore of the lake. You can set up a camp if you want. <laughs> oh, yeah. I like to skip a stone. Ooh. I want to fashion those bear claws into um, into the shuriken. <laughs> okay. As you've done a thousand times before. Mm -hmm. <laughs> probably it's take second you nature. Oh, quite a while. <laughs> I mean, aren't we sleeping for the night? You can take... Yeah. Well, yeah. we should probably do shifts. You can do it on your shift, yeah. Okay. You don't want to be snuck up on, and I say like what you did to I'm Jerry earlier. I'm guessing it's four <laughs> claws per. No, no, three. It's three claws per. I can okay, actually, three. I can show you exactly Triangle. what it looks like. Yeah, yeah. I'd like some visual aid. Yeah, you have enough to make five, and then uh, like a double-ended toe or something. Oh, you took every single paw, even his back legs. Yeah. Anything yeah. On that? yeah. Um, fuck, dude. I don't got anything to nail this fucking piece of shit over to the to the shield. Wait, bears have I do. five. 
They have five toes? Oh, I take it back. I take it back. Uh, well, they have four, four fingers. It's yeah. four per. Yeah, okay. Ooh, so well, you get four. That's not bad. Four even. All right, for now, I'm going to, I guess, tie some rope onto my shield. To attach some of the pelt? <laughs> yeah. That'll work. All right. It's like shit. There you go. That's, yeah, what, looks, that's what they crude. look like, minus the uh, uh, That shit looks melted. Wait, what are you, metal working? Yeah. No, that's what it looks like in the movie, but I think what I'm going to use, uh, just because it would be twine or something? What do you have to do? I have... glue them? I have the sticky spider Hot stuff glue. that was on the wall that was like super super sticky, and the I'm gonna sheet use of it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the, the, the cut sheet of spider web, super sticky. Yeah, I no, no, that. that's the spider web. Oh, I could use the web. Yeah, I'm gonna use the web. I was I'm talking about there was some use. sort of like tar <clears throat> stickiness that I collected. The shit you got in a jar, right? Yeah, the, from the flies. This isn't like a fly, Seth. Yeah, you're yeah. Right. Oh. I didn't know if you already used it. But. I was going to use that with like uh, my string or whatever that I have, but I think I am going to use the the spider web. I'm going to see if I can like form it around it to make little shurikens. Should I roll for that or do I just tell you? Let's, yeah, let's see. <laughs> wait, wait, let's my roll could I determine how good they how are. the quality of them are, yeah. yeah, yeah I would say you're going to make them no matter what, I guess, yeah. but... How much rope do you think hey. I use? I have a 50 foot oh, rope. Oh, yeah, that's why I rolled 20. <laughs> mm. Yeah, yeah no, no. Silence. <laughs> and uh, 18. Oh, Ooh, nice. nice. Yeah, these are, these are some pretty nice ones, too. Damn. So once. Somehow they look just like the picture, including the molar, even <laughs> yeah. though I started with <laughs> this bear claw. Well, you can use, you can, for one of them, you can use my tooth that came yeah. out. I fell out of the tree. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> All right, cool. There you go. Uh, this I, got, my, I see that, you're four, using your four. Shurikens? four. Awesome. Nice. Four shuriken. Yeah. For shuriken. For sure I can. There's a for sure I can. All right, and you're tying yours with rope? Yeah, I, I don't know how to cut down my rope on, on here. Like, it says 50 feet, but obviously I don't. I wouldn't. It's not gonna be fifty. I would say maybe <laughs> what five feet of rope to really tie it on tight. It is just gonna wow. be attached by rope. So if somebody attacks it or cuts it, if they cut the rope, I would think that would loosen it. But that'd be it. Yeah. The goal seems like you're just trying to strap the pelt to it anyway. Even if it gets one use, you know. Well, because if they hit it and it blows spores in their face, I feel like that's that's a dub. Hell yeah. Uh huh. God damn it! So yeah, how do you guys want to? How do you guys want to set up guard? How long do you want to rest? You doing a long rest? Uh, yeah, you you watch. We'll long rest, okay? Huh. Uh, I don't know. Uh, maybe <laughs> like you guards and then you get so maybe, maybe we do it in we do four hour whoever's periods. Whoever's injured first rest first, and then second most injured rest, and then. Yeah, that's fair. And so the the healthiest person does I am exhausted first. though. I have an attribute of Bob being exhausted. Baby Duke are exhausted. So even though I'm not necessarily hurt that bad. So we all agree Breen I'm... should be the first watch. That's really oh, okay, nice. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's no problem. <laughs> Thanks, Breen. Fuck yeah, uh, Breen. Hell yeah. I knew I've we lost should most you. Most my powers, but that's <laughs> easy. I will take the first watch. I know these woods better than any. Keeps okay. himself up talking to himself. Now, if there's danger, but you don't want to go, hey, there's danger. Like, are you gonna give? Do you have like a signal? Are you gonna like like or like a little hoot or anything? I'll make a gentle breeze sound like the wind. That will not wake yeah. me up. Yeah. Did you do like a bear farting or something like that? Maybe like the sound of like ring, ring, ring. Mm -hmm. How about just you screaming, oh my god! <laughs> that would help too. Or like uh, a like a mountain like, lion. Danger, danger. We're gonna die. Yeah. Yeah, I'll mm. I'll do all of those sounds at once. If maybe, I hear all those sounds at once, I might freak out. Though, yeah. So maybe just pick one. It's like a night terror. Uh, I guess yeah. some kind of mountain lion. Oh my god, dude, Ooh, that's, that's gonna dope. scare me. Yeah. Not mine, that's a real natural woodsy but sound. Then uh, yeah. maybe say that it's just me afterward. Yeah, say. Okay, yeah, that actually, that works. It's just me, Breen. <laughs> it's Breen, guys. Breen. 
Oh Wait, gosh. I thought mountain lions sound like women screaming in the night. They, uh, I think they, they, do. Like they They can do both. Uh, sound, yeah, they <laughs> I was hoping that guys, would be his they've thing. Got just screaming <laughs> like a woman. It's like a woman getting stabbed in a fucking yeah. city. <laughs> <laughs> I am uh, not the best at impressions. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, you're bad at first impressions, too. <laughs> Ooh, they, high five. I give, I give Bob yeah, a high five. You know that. that tuna Damn. in that carriage. Not a pretty sight. Yeah. But you know what you're right, good, go you know what you're good at? I'm going to go to bed. Protect me. Stand and watch. <laughs> Right. Yeah, and then I go. I go instead of laying down, I just stand and stare at the pond. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. I hang from my feet from a branch. <laughs> wow. So who's Breen, taking tell me guard a bedtime next? story. Uh, Breen, Breen w- wake you can wake me up after like seven hours, <laughs> and then I'll and then I'll watch. Breen, Pop, <laughs> well, wake me up in like five TV. hours. Yeah, if we. Something. Well, I, how long does a person normally sleep? Twenty hours. We can, if we each take increments of five, yeah. <laughs> we can get through the night. Yeah. Can, it's still night. How is this happening? Uh, uh, I guess like two hours. I don't know. Wake me up in like two hours. All right. That's, get eight that's hours. no we problem. We each do two hours. I'd be so pissed if watch. someone woke me up after Six two hours. hours. Sleep. <laughs> no, I'm saying, well, you're not getting woke. You're getting woken up after six four hours. hours. Or yeah. six hours. Yeah, we'll each do a two hour watch you know uh-huh. okay and uh all right well brain's going first anyway so yep. we're losing sleep time you guys have camping stuff and all that yeah I'm uh, guessing too. yeah i've got a <laughs> what would he call wait no i don't know if i do i've got a pot oh wait i've got a bedroll and i've got a i was just wondering how you guys were sleeping out here I've, I have a bedroll and I have my costumes, oh, my nice. clothing costumes. So I'm gonna fashion them into a, a little bit of a disguise. In that, it's a tent made out of a small small costume tent. <laughs> yeah, like a one person small little tent. Nice. One and a half people. That's excellent. Mm. All right. It's quite comfortable in here. All right, goodbye, everyone. Okay, good night. <laughs> I'm just saying that for just me. It's wow, it's nice in here. Okay. And you, you guys sleep through, and you know, eventually Breen wakes you up, and you do your your shift, and your one hour shift. Let me tell you something. You I do not think I have any way of sleeping. I think I am. I think I'm just. <laughs> yeah, I didn't want to say anything. Here. I don't got a bag or yeah, nothing. Yeah, I'm dude. looking through my. <laughs> I did. I neglected to bring any sort of like camp. I'm gonna huddle room. real close up to Wonder Boy. Uh, hey guys, and but I did have a bear trap for that bear. <laughs> I never used it. God damn, that would have been like nice. <laughs> wow, uh, yeah, that could have that could have really been uh-huh. useful. Huh? And eventually, let's see. Wait, do I wake up? Yeah, you do your shift. It's uneventful. Okay, I do my shift, and it's awesome. Nice. No reports, Dope. hopefully. And just a lot of good time of me. I look up, I see the stars, I face out to the mountains, I walk to each of my compatriots and I stroke them face wise gently. <clears throat> I tuck a little bit of hair behind Jerry's ear. And then don't, I and don't then get too I, close I, to me. No, I, t- I tuck the hair behind your ear and then my hand goes south <laughs> yeah. and I just hold it around your throat for just a moment. <laughs> just a moment I think about it and I linger there a little and I say, he's going down a path I cannot follow. <laughs> and I, my other hand, I have Hugh's throat and I'm just looking so, so fragile a man can be. And then I... Go into my and I wake one of them up when it's their turn. But I do a look at some creepy things, but not really creepy. Just, just I'm standard cackling and yeah. just standard, just like what if I while he's asleep, what if I could? Because he's go, he's turning crazy and he's gonna try to kill me at some point. What? You're going crazy yeah. in your own way. <laughs> I'm going. I'm getting a little paranoid that both of you are very clearly. You have mushrooms growing out of your skin, and we just were attacked by a bear. My that back that is same smoldering shit. and, and yeah. smells of a yeah. tire fire. I so, I know you are fucked, dude. <laughs> yeah. I, I probably got to bring that up in the morning. <laughs> Forgot about that. Yep. Hold a mirror to your to you. Okay. Q, I need you to give me a roll. 
Oh, God. You want me to roll? I should have brought it up Three. before you went to bed. Yeah. Big dice. 18. Well, you know, like a venom? Okay. You're cheating. All right. So you're taking all of Brian's rolls. He hot swapped the fucking... You're dude, unable dude. to sleep basically the entirety of the night. What? Uh, during <laughs> your shift. I told you, I just stood there and looked at the lake for like 12 hours. Oh. <laughs> just standing stoically. It's really creepy. You, you oh, okay, like so when you were awake when I held something? my hand like, to your throat. Like <laughs> yeah. You hear a rustling you saw me. from the tall grass. <laughs> the small and mischievous mitts oh. of a young plan oh. snatcher is already gripped at your back, attempting to slide the wingtip shoes away. The young plan snatcher hisses as though his hands have been burnt or bitten. Ooh. That'd be creepy as fuck. You can't even turn your neck that yeah, well. Yeah. My, my <laughs> arms are in my chest cavity area. Yeah. Yeah. Um, oh. So I guess roll actually a second time for disadvantage. Oh. Wait, Sam, let's roll again? That's well, say so you noticed that, that. 10. Okay. Yeah, you can't get your arms out from the side to defend yourself. <laughs> make, an, make a mountain lion noise. <laughs> And so it is successfully able to slide the wingtip shoes away. Oh. You, you feel tired no more, but also hardly feel like yourself. A sense of seething anger shoots through your veins, pumping hatred into your heart. Frustrated with someone. It seems like him. being imprisoned for some time. Images of a spidery frame and the shadows sting your subconscious before a strange God. sense of glee comes crashing over Ooh. you. A maddening sort of glee. Freedom! A voice screams <laughs> all around you, echoing in your ears. Or was that perhaps that? inside your head? Your body begins to move uncontrollably as Chester grips tighter into your skin. Ironic that he would be shouting freedom, you have to think to yourself, before a sense of panic starts to trickle in. Uh, is that like, what? what's that on your head? Wait, what, is <laughs> he, that, that, he grew wait, why is that, that my, like, that's my die? I have You that have thing. this? Yeah. No, I've got this that skull what? thing. I've got what the is that your, is, wait, so, is that your like is that a camera or yeah, is that just a, a JPEG? Camera. Okay, I thought it was a yeah. JPEG. Oh, I was what? You to bought one of these two? Oh, you've, I've seen me use this before. No, someone, so. someone mine's got a little in. spider. Yeah. Oh, mine's oh, got a spider cool. on top. Dang, is, okay, so we have two. That's cool. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that is. Was I supposed to? Remember, was I supposed to transform? This was like a year ago. Yeah, remember when I used to try to okay. shoot a crossbow is this camera a into it? End, or are we are we gonna kill this thing right now, dude? Kill this thing! I'm your dear friend. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Brian, let's do it. Yeah. I'm yeah. your beloved friend. Why are you so angry at me? Do I look different? <laughs> Are we awake? <laughs> are we still asleep? Yeah, yeah. We, yeah like that's kind of horrible. Yeah, I go over there and I snuff out their fucking. No, you, you, you wake up as, as you hear all the commotion going on and. What the? Oh my and, god! And oh my god! Green, who had taken first watch, begins. Oh, it's me, Green. <laughs> and alerts you. Mountain lion, Green, wait. What the hell are you? Uh, go ahead and roll for initiative. Oh fuck! I'm gonna kill him. Me? Do I roll? No. I got a. Uh, You're 18 gonna go first. Plus two. So 20. Let's see. 14 plus two. Actually, yeah, let's have you, have 16. you roll. 16. Wait, no, 14 plus one. 15. I got 20 and 15. <laughs> Give me a roll here. Yeah. What is that? Uh, the thing's hard to kind of tell. Yeah, I know. That's why I think I stopped using it so quickly. Uh, is that an 18? I think that's a 1. 18. <laughs> All right. So, Fuck. JB. It, they are loaded, though. Too. Yeah. It's funny. It's like the exact same skull part, but mine's got a spider. I bet you it's just some, like... It's the same file, but they <laughs> yeah. put a spider on <laughs> I it. I think they just get them off a database or some shit and 3D <clears> print them. <throat> Yeah. Right, so JB, you will start the fight. We're gonna fight this right now. Oh my god! You've rested up through the night. Yeah. Mm. So you're feeling pretty yeah, good. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Aim uh, for the face part. It'll kill the monster. <laughs> yeah. Go right for the head. <laughs> Aim for the little man's face. <laughs> it's it's, it's weak spot. <laughs> <laughs> 
Without the host, the body will fail. I know this. <laughs> it's, it's true. Fact. It's true. <laughs> Wait, right. is that little... Is that little cretin that got the shoes to run off, or is it still yeah, like, around? It's, it's, yeah, what the hell? Did that thing, like, run away in terror, or what? It burned its hands, and it dropped the remains of the wingtips to the ground. How much remains? Uh, just the lace part that wraps around the heel. Oh. The entire front is oh, gone. The heel is partially worn. It, it looks Jerry like uh, choke Sam to death martial arts that. foot wrap is basically what's left. One oh, of those little ankles, sweet. or like an ankle brace amount left, maybe. That's cool. It smells terrible. Wait, so who's first? I guess it's my Baby. turn first. Oh fuck, dude. Uh, does does looking for like weaknesses take a turn or what? What are you talking about here? Well, that's a minor action. All right. So well, first of all, I'm gonna look for a weak point that isn't his fucking head. <laughs> not my thighs. Dude, not my beautiful me, thighs. Give me, give me a roll. All right. Is it perception? Yeah, we can do perception. Good eyes. Yeah, do perception. All right. I got an 18 plus three. The 21. Yeah, you notice two areas that seem like they might be weak points, both the top knot and the area on the back where the uh, shoes' wingtips were appear that to still be little... melted in, as though they're sore and tender from, uh, yeah. from, from whatever they were put through, being squeezed by the wingtips. Uh, of course, it's hair and back. <laughs> two, weak, two weak spots. I'm going to shoot my javelin right at the hair like an apple yeah. on someone's head. Try to <laughs> not miss. <laughs> oh, no, I rolled a two. Oh, fuck. All right. Uh, well, the first thing I'm going to do is fucking, I guess, take the little dagger from Baby Duke and prick myself and activate my glove powers. Because I know how it works. Attack All right. Titan. Okay. Yeah. Uh, all right. Yeah. I'm going to try to fucking punch him. Okay. Give me <laughs> I want to I want to wait to use the the personality thing until next session cuz I ordered things. <laughs> so, I mean, you should just embrace it when it's active, you're active. Oh, don't you worry, baby. Don't you worry. All, All right. right. Uh You have plus 4 to hit with it. So, what did you get? I I got a 8 plus 4. Yeah. It it's not a, it, you're not successful. You're able to connect oh. with it, but the Chester suit rebounds your attack. Ooh. Fuck. Scoffingly. Oh my god. You got big rolls. <laughs> are you like still in there? Yeah, I'm you, in here and you... I'm like, what the fuck, well, JB? You... Why did you attack me? What? You psycho? <laughs> Look at What's you. What's wrong with you? Look at you. Look, look, at, even look at me. Look at anything. I, I can just kind of like rotate my head a little bit. And like, yeah. I, I still am wearing my awesome Chester outfit. What gives? We had to roll initiative, dude. This is on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bob, grab his little turn. top knot. Chester Hume. Oh, yeah. yeah you right just tried to punch you in the, the like... gut, but wasn't really able to phase Chester. Oh, no. That's a five. <laughs> what are you attempting got... to do? You're just. <laughs> he, he's got summoning <laughs> sickness. No, it counts. He rolled a five. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever yeah, what, he what wants. What are you trying to do? Uh, I'm assuming Chester is attacking in some regard. Yeah. Mm. I have stretchy arms. Big assumption. And so Chester's probably going to do some sort of crazy ass swiping. That seems like, likely. Yeah, like whatever those those long arm things are from um, that, Jerry. that quiet, quiet place <clears throat> movie. Yeah, I mean, your thoughts are intertwined with Chester's at this point. You would be aware of, of what, what they're he's going doing? to attempt. Okay. Yeah. Chester's about to swipe at you, dog. <laughs> I'm gonna Chester's, try Chester's to pierce about to fuck you up, heart, dude. Motherfucking I'm not feeling yeah. this right now. I'm not getting this aggression, but uh, he Get is him, straight Chester. up about to swing at you. Me. Oh, honestly, the calmest he's been in ages. That <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, he's he's really going for like a, a throat slash belly slash kill shot. At JB. If you hit my throat, belly, and, and, and head kill? at the same time, it could kill me and the <laughs> kill shot. All weak spots. At, at, the kill zone. Be, like, who are you talking about hitting? <laughs> oh, me? Um, JB, I'm assuming. Yeah. I mean, good. everybody's yeah. close to you. You're all at yeah. the He said JB. Yeah, yeah, JB. He swung at me. <laughs> and so Chester's reactive. Yeah. yeah, he's a reactive type. All right, give me a roll. He got a five. I got a we five. Yeah, it. that's what I was, I was rolling yeah, yeah. for. Uh, I was <laughs> oh, just okay. going to immediately counterattack, you know? Yeah, and, and maybe it's Hughes' will holding it back, but Chester is unable. Don't JB swing. Yeah. Don't do it, Dodge Chester. It <laughs> Don't Remember swing. the wingtips, oh. Chester. If you had hit that, you would have been like, yes. <laughs> yeah. 
I'm constantly in a uh, absolutely strained trying to restrain Chester. Yeah. You're not doing a good job at all. Just to give my arms back. That's why the arms are so stretchy because I got my real arms still grabbing my dick and balls. Oh, so don't yeah. aim for the dick and oh, balls. Guys. <laughs> uh, wait, is it my turn? All right, correct. Okay. Fuck. I should have been thinking about what I was going to do this whole time. I'm still knife. Uh, I know it's like wait, because I'm a bard, but because I've... Bizzle, you know, he, he makes that. Let me assist him with whatever. Let me use my passive. Oh, yes. What does that do? Yes, he's assisted me. Yeah. Gives him, gives him advantage uh, on his roll. Boom. Sure? I'm helping you out, brother, right there. Aim for the knife. <laughs> I would not. I did not put my hand to your throat while you slept. <laughs> this is why. Thank God. F him up. Okay. Uh, wait. Where is uh, Richter? Ooh, he's wherever you guys like left him. I tied him up to my tent. <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> what? <laughs> to my tent. I have yeah, okay. a little string. Oh, he's just over there. Okay. Vibing. Uh, I'm going to walk up to him, and I'm going to put the speaking spell on his head. All right. And I'm going to say, it's your time to unleash the beast, Richter. My dog of war. Are you ready to fight for us? <laughs> Uh, finally, I've been waiting yeah. for so long. <laughs> and then I'm going to point him at the direction of you and say, "Okay, I'm now going to point. Th I'm going to thrust you towards your enemy. <laughs> it's the long-armed, not Jerry, the so, gooey. All right, got long arms. Check. No, Send me and, the long one without the and, the shit in the pants. Yeah, <laughs> it's the one that doesn't smell like he shit his pants. I don't know if can he smell. Probably not. I, look, I can't smell what? anything. Oh, fucking asking okay. guy with no head. <laughs> Can you smell? Yeah. Is, yeah. is the suit making a noise? Like a, <laughs> like like a squeaking? whining? Like a yeah, is it like squeaking? Oh, it is latex. Yeah, I, th I would think it would be making some squeaky Go sound. Go towards the... Oh, attack the latex! Now fight! And I <laughs> shove him, and that's that'll be my move. I'm sending out my champion. All right. And... No holdbacks. Uh, baby Duke just <laughs> cheers him on. Yeah, baby Duke. Yeah, we Richter. will. We will know when to strike. Uh, Can my green. assist action be giving Baby Duke his other dagger back? Yeah, I mean, that, that could be something. Mm. Uh, and Breen. Oh, can I hold the assist action till next time? I actually have to like. I can do it every turn, can't I? Oh yeah, Jesus uh, Christ! You mean using well, that help. shit all the time? I didn't know. I don't know what it. Does. I didn't realize. You use that every turn. <laughs> Holy fuck! We're gonna have an advantage every time no, we've only, done it's something. It's only if you have if you're within like a certain amount of feet with We're me. We're always so, all uh, together. Well, last time I ran away, <laughs> and <laughs> no. I forgot I had it. Well, one oh of them is God. because you're a mastermind rogue, which yeah. has some something master of for tactics. it. I don't yeah, know. really I mastermind. <laughs> It was and I know you have to be within, into... yeah, you're supposed to be within five feet of each other, I guess. So you're supposed five to be feet, right okay. up on each other. Mm. Monster, Whatever monster. that is. British bastard. <laughs> Those are good, though. Quite. Okay. And it's, I guess it's supposed to be granted on the next attack or something. I don't know. But I would assume uh, if you guys are right there next, next to each other, then you would be able to. Yeah, I'll save it for next turn. What's Breen up to? You? Mm -hmm. Is he gonna pull out that shillelagh again? Yeah, sorry, I was just reading. Whichever option you choose, man, it goes with. Okay. Yeah. I was gonna say because that shit's OP. I hope Richter can rip your head off. <laughs> Puts it on his <laughs> body. It's, it's, <laughs> it is your action, though. So technically, I think you. Me? No, no, no. I'm saying if you help. Oh. Helping is an action, just like attacking oh, or so hiding or whatever. Turn. Kind of, yeah. You lose your major you action. Dagger, baby, dude, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do it next time. Uh, do it uh, never. Uh, and Breen. Let's see. Uh, yeah, he's going to attack the shillelagh. Cool. And... <laughs> Oh, wait, that's kind of hardcore. When I die, eventually, I'll put this up. It is a hit. Four. 
Fuck this. Damn, for six bludgeoning damage. Damn. He fucked. Hell yeah. He, Where does he, he hit him? Comes up to, it, he's able to reach into one of those. It's completely accidental, but he clobbers the shillelagh with an overhead swing into the smoldering back of uh. Chester, <gasps> right where the wingtip used to be. <laughs> Good. Hugh he does feel the pain. Ah, it burns! <laughs> in for the arms, asshole! The arms! My arms are not in its arms! Wow. Oh, okay. Yeah. I wish I would have known that earlier. Fuck! <laughs> Open with that. The hit though, Breen. God bless. <laughs> hmm. Breen, you're doing, uh, helping out a lot. And then it's it's Richter's turn. <laughs> and the blind Richter Kane that you've sent in there takes a swing at Hugh. He has to have disadvantage or some shit, yeah. right? No. Like, yeah. 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 Fucking blind He's guy. Totally and, and it is a mess. He okay. goes in initially just kind of swinging his arms wildly looking for something. <laughs> And like a right very shot, bad Richter. game of Marco Polo, yeah, he's unable to get a grip on Chester. Kind of Focus. just nimbly strafes around. Listen with your rather ears. clumsy. Listen, listen. My my ears are in the middle of a desert right now. <laughs> <laughs> listen with your robot ears. <laughs> They're hearing aids. And also the guy in the suit He's just calmly asshole, drinking something like while, <laughs> while we're fighting for our life He's like well Yeah you see What are you eating a go-go squeeze or yeah, I got a uh, <laughs> Where do you get that? I got a camelback <laughs> inside Chester What? You like it in there I know you <laughs> yeah. do dude he, I mean, to him He's it's not just even a really putting up a fight I don't, I don't like that I don't like that he's turned But I like the accommodations All right. <laughs> I'm sorry I, It's right. awesome in here <laughs> Alright JB Kill shot. It's time. <laughs> I'm gonna try to fucking grab onto his stupid little top knot. And fucking I would burn really prefer. On my it. neck is still attached to that. I would really prefer it if he went for the arms. The arms don't kill anyone. No, you never I'm kill a guy you. by I'm ripping their arms off. Yeah, but you hair. disarm him, which is what you're trying to. You're not trying to kill. You're trying to disarm. We're trying to kill Chester. I'm decapitating. Give me a roll. <laughs> All right, baby dick. Let's go. I got five. JB. Fuck. I got a five. <laughs> Gotta, I, I stab again? my hand into JB's oh, yeah. belly and tear out his aorta. <laughs> and one spell swoop. If I saw that, I'd fly away with my fly <laughs> ability. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm it's, out. A, it's, a, it's a definite miss. Oh, fuck. Ooh. Chester's able to keep you God at damn, bay, Jerry. shoves you I'm out blind. of the way. You don't hurt him, but he doesn't hurt you. Okay. And. No, it's me. Okay. Um. <clears throat> Chester, this is Chester, not me, of course, is going to try to plant his hands on the ground like a couple outriggers and then do a two-footed oh. spike kick towards Breen since Breen was the last person oh, that attacked him. Two, oh, it was Jerry. Yeah, Jerry Wait, attempted hits, but landed. didn't hurt. All right. Uh, <laughs> all right. Give me a roll. Those are like the SpongeBob boots that he walks in the guy's eyes with. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's fucked. I'm, I'm doing this by feel and by looking at my webcam. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ. What a great combo. That's a, why can't you read this? It's yeah. a two, baby. Oh, man. Great attack. Yeah. So far yeah. as the ring Thank engaging. God. And it's a dramatic <laughs> it's display sad. as you kick your legs back. Uh, I'm it starting sick. to this think he might be able to bring to the ground and they go over his threat. head. He's able to dodge, and it's Pob's turn. It looked deadly Jerry, there, didn't it? What if we tied it super deadly. Like a bunch of bricks to him and threw him in the lake that were right by, <laughs> and we drown Chester <laughs> and save oh, you? Oh, like a little bolo? <laughs> yeah. <to> go, <laughs> he I don't think he can swim in that, dude. What if we save him by drowning out the shoot? I'll sit, I'll sit at the bottom of the lake like fucking Jason <laughs> Voorhees. <laughs> yeah. I'll have Chester okay. create a breathing apparatus for me. How far drink. away am I from Chester? Because I haven't moved yet from my tent. You were all essentially around the campfire, oh, so you goodness. would be uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, campfire's distance this across from This is a nightmare. This is a nightmare. It has to be. You're probably about 10 feet away. I wish we were all best friends. Uh, I'm going to walk 10 feet further away. <laughs> Back up once again. A pattern here. Uh, 
Yeah, well, I don't <laughs> want this dude to, now that I know, know he can do this move where he plants his arms and kicks with spikes, I don't want Baby Duke anywhere near that. So I'm going to walk, yeah, like 10 feet over, and then I'm going to pull out my awesome boomerang and attempt a throw. One. <laughs> Wait, no, it's a seven. This is miserable. This it's is a seven. Oh, it's I a love seven a, plus I love, two. I, love I see the Nine. studio cam come yeah, in, or the eight. studio light come in yeah. for a second. Well, dude, the first time <laughs> yeah. I did this, I don't know what's changed. I didn't need to put my phone in it every time. I'm on 5% battery. I'm getting scared. But, okay, I... I got a nine. <laughs> and it's a miss. You're able to still catch the boomerang as it comes back to you. Okay, then but... I fly. I miss and it comes back and I don't have a line for this queued up, but I say, boom. <laughs> <laughs> or ang. Ooh. Yeah. I, there's nothing funny about this. Okay, and then I turn. I, I, I walk five more feet away. <laughs> <laughs> And Baby <laughs> Duke is kind of squirming, trying to get closer with its two daggers. Let we will get out of here. In. I need to get him two boomerangs. I can carve him out uh, of here. Oh, <laughs> I do like that. I like the idea of that. Okay, next turn. Don't, I mean, next when I, in a minute, when I can walk again. I don't know what you call it in game. When I am able to move again, we will get closer. <laughs> Is that more realistic than saying yes. next turn? Yeah, you know. You're, you're prepping. I'm unfrozen yeah. from these confines. Yeah. yeah Let me plan. <laughs> it's like three turns in a row or nothing's happened. <laughs> Brie takes it. Uh, I know. Let's see. And Breen... Hit him again. <laughs> just hit him again at the fucking thing. <laughs> Breen is yeah. just going to swig wildly. Yeah. And it, it's it's like, the most that's happened. Unfortunately, it's a miss. It's just a, it, a series of missing going <laughs> on. Out of here. <laughs> it's still dark a little. Yeah. <laughs> it's still... My eyes. And it's uh, right, Richter, he was the close last this. And, close this for us, Richter. Richter my man. has just been diving on the floor looking for the body. Still can't seem to locate him. Oh, Am I getting closer? I, 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 somebody, <laughs> I don't. let me know. As he you slithers say around something. on the ground. Help him locate you. It's not my <laughs> turn. <over> He's dead <laughs> silent. <laughs> Holding his breath. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, clearly his little top head's too elusive. I'm going to try to uppercut him in the fucking groin area. See if I can make yeah, him feel it. Like, you know what I mean? Bro, yeah. kill, kill I'm going for dick. a fucking rising yeah. uppercut into his ball sack. Uh, all right, well, I gotta roll this. All right, come on, I want to see a dice game on this one. <laughs> what, 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 yeah. what do I? What do I have to get on this? What do I have to get oh, to land? Shit, a hundred? I, I didn't even know AC. I could roll that. What? I'm not gonna just tell you his AC. <laughs> oh fuck! Yeah. All right, I figured my well, my uh, have, my pat down. Well, I mean your glove right. has. You have, yeah, you have plus four to oh, your baby. hit chance. So add four I, to whatever you're doing on this. I feel good about this one. I got an eighteen plus four. Okay. I believe him. So you're definitely able <laughs> to connect. What we, are we trying to grab him or uppercut him? What are you doing here? No, I was trying to uppercut his nutsack because I was sick of trying to <laughs> hit the fucking... He's going to break Hugh's fingers. <laughs> yeah, I want to push it so balls. hard. Hey, fuck it. Man, my hands it. are covering <laughs> them things. Him up a little bit. Right. Yeah. So it's, He's you can break your hands. 1d6 and then 1d8. Holy for fire shit. Damage. What? Are you serious? Yeah. All right. Big rolls. Come on, bitch. All right, big rolls, baby. Wait, I got to find the six dice. Oh, which one is it? It's the regular dice. Oh yeah, you're right. Holy shit! <laughs> I know it gets Ugh. weird when you use just. But I'm so used to see these die. fucking crystal balls of fucking yeah. dice, dude. It's like insane. All right, here, a D6 first. D6 and a D8. Fire All right, that's damage. a five, baby. Ooh, five. Let's go. And is this D8? All right. The diamond. Come on, come on, come on. Big number. Ooh. I got a seven. Oh. So, holy dog shit, dude. That's damn. You feel the that's burn, a ball bitch. It's a powerful strike. And ah! as you hit directly into the groin of Chester Hugh, you can tell he, <laughs> he felt that one. Uh, the legs <gasps> kind of I, I actually, I kind of puked. I, I puke down onto JB's head a little bit yeah. instantly. <laughs> Which is kind of unfortunate, actually, because it might actually be hurting Hugh at this point. 
Uh, well, if you know what, it's not you unfortunate dancing, if it hurts him just a little. I mean, he <laughs> yeah. deserves one or two ball taps at this point. Yeah. Ball taps. This guy just he rolled like a twenty-two glove. up. And <laughs> he used a flaming glove. glove that he had dipped in some sort of sacred oath blood or whatever. And the Chester suit it appears me. to. It's like it's breathing heavy at this point. You can tell that that last blow <clears throat> shook it quite a bit. Thank God. Guys, it shook. Wait, haven't I and you, I feel it. I feel a tremor. Yeah. You, it's your turn. <laughs> Quick, keep hitting him there. <laughs> yeah. it's doing the ball, so guys, like whatever you just did it's really not. fucked him up. I can tell. Yeah, yeah. They're smoldering like the back now. Uh, keep hitting there. Okay, I, I'm doing another one of those planted hand foot spike attacks, uh, but this time towards JB. He only has two moves. Yeah. <laughs> Be careful. He could have a second form. <laughs> Give it a roll. Oh, yeah, yeah. I got a roll for that. Dude, you were like role playing like you're in that suit for real. It's, it's, it's crushing him. <laughs> you need to, when you're done with this arc, you need to get a regular fucking camera yeah, going yeah, like, so you're not. Shit. Uh, that is an insanely low roll. No, that's an eight. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> this is like a, is we're cool. just fighting a practice dummy. This <laughs> yeah. is, it's not, not even... a very impressive final battle. <laughs> it's sure. like our first boss fight. Yeah. yeah. And, uh, yeah, that's, you, you're unable to hit Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I don't think you have to worry about this. Just a couple more hits and I should be out of here. Yeah. I'm not even really yeah. concerned anymore. Uh, I'm gonna close my eyes uh, and nap for the rest of this. Yeah, <laughs> my yeah. turn. Yeah, Ice my balls. Turn. All right, all right. Don't worry, you. A couple more hits. I got just what you need, and I unsheath my my harpoon. <laughs> there she go. And I'm going right for the blowhole. I'm going right for his belly button yeah. <laughs> area. I'm just gonna go with the epic. Chained throw. <laughs> Please get the top knot. <laughs> Please, get Please the go top. for the top knot, not my fucking belly. <laughs> <laughs> or his ball sack. <laughs> yeah, don't go center mass. I'm going, I'm going, no, I'm going. Uh, I'm going to walk like 10 feet up, make sure I'm in range. I'm going to shoot that thing right at your balls. <laughs> All right, hold on. Big roll. I need a big roll here. I might have to use this inspiration I've been holding for like fucking eight months. I don't know. <laughs> Eleven plus two. Thirteen. It's it's Is that it? it's not enough. Uh, <laughs> Are you gonna be inspired? No, I'm saving it because there's never been another one dished out. Right, you, so I don't know. And... Shit towards his his groin and belly button, but maybe because you were trying to pick high or low. <laughs> Uh, he... The long limbs of Chester are able to extend very nimbly around it, and it misses. Can you do that cartoon thing where they always like lift, lift their... their bottom yeah, half off? Exactly. That's exactly what it <clears> is. <throat> and then it shoots under, and then I pull it back like scorpion. Yep. <laughs> and, and then I catch it, and I go, I've got nothing again for this situation. Uh, How close are you? I'm like. I don't know, like 10 feet, 20 feet away, I think's my, like, throwing range. 10 feet. 10 feet. 20, 30 foot range. I'm 10 feet away. Well, because it has a 10 foot chain. And then if I can, right? I'm going I'm to walk 10 more feet away again. <laughs> I don't know if <laughs> I can do that. Between 10 and 20 <laughs> feet away. <laughs> and you thought I'm your turns him. were I'm useless. I'm trying to kite him. Uh, I, I, At I'm least I'm walking. I'm sitting here with my bloodlust. <laughs> as Baby Duke it's resumes okay. doing nothing. Bringing Sometimes over, watching is better. You know, the surprise second most valuable player in this fight so far. <laughs> comes kind of out. the best. <laughs> if he MVP. hits this, he's the MVP. Yeah. <laughs> he is able to hit. Yeah, it's yeah, pretty yeah, good thing idea to bring him, and now he's beating the shit yeah, out of him. Go for a ball buster. <laughs> yeah, I did not scream. It's... <laughs> How much? Six points of damage. Oh, yes. hell yeah. And this, this blow to the... It's a leaping blow to the top knot. And as he hits it, it oh. sends Chester down onto his knees momentarily. Ooh. Blow your dick, Is boys. you, like, dying <laughs> from these? Yeah. Are you fine. Uh, and it's Richter's turn. <laughs> Richter, he's on his knees right in front of you. <laughs> yeah, come on. This is, this is Roadhouse. easy. Roadhouse. Richter attempts... 
to grab you if you give me a roll. Grab <laughs> him by the ears and rip his ears off. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> rip his whole fucking head. <laughs> yeah, rip, rip the skin off the face, Rector. <laughs> uh, that is a. Um, see and then whatever. Is. And then add your strength, which in Chester is. Is that a 10? 15? Oh. Okay. In Chester. Wait. Is. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, so Richter Kane uh, is useless. He tries to grab a hold of your body, but you feel a sudden surge of strength through the Chester suit, and it's able to lift him up and basically it throws the body out towards Pob and misses him barely. Whoa! But Richter lands about 10 feet or 20 feet away. Okay. All right, Richter, you put up a good try. Maybe take a rest. It's JB's rest. turn. All right. He's on his knees now. All right. I was. I, I pull out my cock. <laughs> All right, is he back? Is he back yeah, up? He's whipping his cock out? He's still feel kind like... of in in the kneeling, but he's active and angry. Dude, discombobulate. He's down to my level, though. Clap right, gonna... with your big glove and shield in his head and crush him. <laughs> I'm going to try to give him a flaming noogie with my fire gauntlet right oh, in the top knot. That but would hurt. Cool all right, baby, let's go. You could do a wicked Indian burn with that, too. I got a 14 plus four. That's an 18, baby. Ooh. Oh, nice. Ooh, baby. Yeah, you're able to get him in the uh, in the noogie position. Oh, this is going to really burn, right. and, it, bitch. and it burns all the Hughes hair off. <laughs> <laughs> He's bald. You got like a monk bald spot right in the top of yeah. <laughs> From where he like, like a fryer or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's like a badass. Only the, only the Larry David parts were left untouched. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh, fuck. Uh. <laughs> I think we got some hair, hair growth serums mm. and stuff. Yeah, we, we, yeah, you might be fixed. Uh, am I rolling damage here? Yeah, D6 and a D8. Oh my god, that's busted. I got a three. That is really good. I got a three. <laughs> Boomerang does one D4. And a, and a six. Three and a six. That's nine. Let's go. And as you do, the Chester suit sizzles and howls and the tap out. inflicts Taps. pain into Hugh as it squeezes tighter and tighter. <laughs> Your eyes start bugging out. Yeah. It, starts <laughs> it looks like uh, with a total recall or some shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's Hugh's turn. Oh, yeah. Um, <clears throat> I... Uh, I do the discombobulate move on on JB. No, <laughs> I shouldn't have said that. But with the, instead of having just the palms, I, I I put the hands to points. So it's like two fucking oh. like drills, like bee drill things in each ear. Oh shit! Oh, that could really leave a mark. Yeah, that could fuck him up. I might have said I think too that much would kill on that. Jerry. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Give me a roll with advantage. I'm doing this oh, out of fuck. love with advantage. <laughs> All right, Jerry, the face part's free game now. He's oh, we're good. We're good. Shot. The Chester fucking sucks. It's a fall. No, advantage. Oh, what's it? Advantage. Oh, oh, do another again. one? Okay. Means you rolled twice. Oh, damn. Okay, so four. He's writhing. Oh, my God. You are so <laughs> fucked. That's a total. Oh, my fuck. God. No. What the? What's the crit? Pizzle, you fucking asshole. Why, why, why did you give him another roll? So because Jerry is latched onto you in that noogie position. Uh -huh. Oh, my God. I figure it's like he's grappling you, where if he kept holding onto you, it's going to keep doing fire damage. But you also get advantage on attacking him because he's directly on top of your body. Gotcha. Oh, no. So it's easier for you to land a hit than if he was not. Hmm. And he crits, so Jerry's dead. Yep, that's it for me. Wait, yeah, well, how much damage does a spiked discombobulate do on a person? <laughs> yeah. a, a, critical, like a critical gonna, spike it, discombobulate, dude. He's, he's, he's going to be a spike going through my brain. That's what yeah. he has to put that speaking yeah. spell on. on his fucking decapitated body. <laughs> God, dude. And we don't well, uh, have any I revives or anything. About as dangerous as it gets, so I would say that's <laughs> two two d ten worth of damage. Oh, I'm gonna die. You might. Oh, no, you're fine. All right, Sam. Big rolls here. Uh, big which rolls. ones are the d tens? Uh, it looks like a diamond. Oh no, it looks like a fucking dreidel. Okay. Yeah, you should be familiar with that. Yeah. Hold on. Uh, oh yeah, I got a four. 
this thing. Are, I don't. Oh my god. Is that it? D10? I don't know. Does it have a 10 on it? No. Is that a fucking. Is that the diamond thing? If, it's, if it has a zero, that's it. Yeah, yeah. It does have a zero. No, no. It's not a diamond. It's a dreidel. Yeah. It's got yeah, more sides. Yeah, that's it? it. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, roll that twice. Oh my good god. Oh my god. Oh, right, it's good knowing you guys. Big it's hit. been fun. D D was a blast. <laughs> Eight and one. Okay. Oh. So that's nine? Oh my <laughs> lord. Yeah. Yeah, nine? Is that nine damage? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's been underwhelming yeah, a little. Yeah, that was a little bit underwhelming. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I thought it was just nine total. I didn't realize you rolled both of them. Okay. Yeah, yeah. N yeah, nine in total. I mean, that still does big damage to Jerry. But what happened to his ears? Are his ears fucked up? Yeah. Well, you're going to have to describe it. Um, well, I don't want to... Like, peel off with the hands. <laughs> you, you put him on the brink of unconsciousness with this attack, uh, the amount of damage that it did do. Oh, uh, that sucks. Yeah, I actually end up so ripping off you feel. all the... <laughs> I rip off all the bits that are, like, his ear lobe areas, so... Not my bits! Yeah. <laughs> so he just has, like, sweaty holes, like... Ew. Yeah, like those dudes that oh, go through God. like car fires and stuff, and they lose their ears. Uh, and just a little hole there. Yeah, even a more horrific yeah. looking person. He's got like yeah. orc ears now. <laughs> it's just like yeah. a little yeah. a little hole in the side of his head. My lobes, dude. Yeah. It's like oversized <laughs> it gauges. It, it keep like... that hood up even more, <laughs> like that. And it perfectly cuts ear holes in yeah. his hood, so now you can see them. And blood is pouring <laughs> yeah, from the ear holes of Jerry Beetleman. Uh, I bet you, without having like the the ear part of your ear, like if you take that hood probably off, it's probably like on all ear checks. Yeah, he probably can't hear so good. I bet you his ears ring a lot. It's probably got tinnitus now. Yeah. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that's just like me. Probably be better if you just kill yeah. them. Yeah, it's Pop's turn. All right. You should not have done that to <laughs> Jerry <laughs> Beetleman. <laughs> and I ready my javelin one more time. You will regret that. You've gone too far. And I, I, I cock back my epic weapon. And I let one blast right for the balls again. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Such a terrible blow. An 11 plus 2 again. 13. <laughs> Wait! He throw it in the exact same way. And he does the no. and then he up his middle and No, instead of picking up my middle, my, my feet spikes simply grow longer and I kind of uh, just get up a little bit higher off the ground. Excellent. Yeah. Oh, and then man. I pull it back and I catch it and I go, wow, I would have thought by the second time I'd have something cool to say here. I still am wildly unprepared. Okay. Well, and then I walk five more feet away. And Brian, seeing how effective... <laughs> Brian, keep doing your fucking... <laughs> Brian, Brian, you keep doing He's like hitting me with the branch. It's not even anything yeah. cool. It's a goddamn stick. He's able stick. to come back again. He's just a whirlwind with this thing. <laughs> yeah. Wop, wop, wop. And he hits you for two points of damage. At, yeah, at, get fucked. At this point, Chester is really sputtering. The, uh. the fresh blood of Jerry Beetleman motivated him for a moment, but the smack again to the back of the head with the shillelagh from Brain uh, stole that brief moment of joy, knocking him back into the moment, the painful moment. Uh, Richter Kane is slithering... Uh, about 15 Richter, feet away. follow my voice. God damn it, I'm, he's on and me. Rights himself to his feet and charges towards Jerry Beetleman where he then stumbles again, uh, fall, <laughs> falling, tripping over some camping gear as he lands about five feet away. Wonder Boy, help. <laughs> yeah, Wonder Boy, don't let this happen to me. It's <laughs> no, it's a, so wait, how does the grapple work? I'm like, I'm giving him a, like... Yeah, you're, or yeah, something? You're, you're still latched onto him. Okay. <laughs> Just uh, with your ears not helping you're, anyway. you're still using yeah. the, the noogie? I took a real bad hit for that, I bet. Like, well, what? So Do, doesn't he burn or something again. when I'm holding him? Yeah, you get to roll What's the that? D8 for fire damage again. 
Bef before I fight? Before or? you even do anything, yeah. Oh my god, please you're burn. Just, just I no hope game. you die! Alright, hold on, let me see. I think I got the wrong dice. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I hate this. Alright, alright. Alright, seven. D okay, oh, that's gotta hurt, go. dude. That's a seven. That's a real... Melt his little uh, hand real, off, dude. Yeah, it burns the Larry David parts <laughs> off. You, you, you burn the top knot down just straight to the chest or skull at this point. And you're just well, rubbing it aggressively. And the, yeah. the Chester suit falls to the ground. He's <laughs> oh, uh, huge like in there. <laughs> yeah. You get, you get the idea that the suit or one of them is about to die here. It's pretty soon. You're not sure which. Uh, we do the full uh, naked body me, guys. sweaty I'm yeah. it's no, fine. No, one of you is going to die. One of you is going to die real yeah. soon. You could still attack now if you wanted. Oh fuck! All right. Well, okay. Do I have no, any? Do I have any advantage for holding on to him right now? Yeah. Like, do I get a better roll? Yeah, you get an advantage on hit. Okay. Fuck it. Thank you. Roll twice. Right, take right. the iron. One. Try to punch him in the face part. <laughs> yeah. He ripped your ears out, dude. You gotta <laughs> yeah, break his look nose. Any, going to Owen look Wilson remorseful nose. at all. I don't. <laughs> I, I, I fucking. I hate that. And he stole your glove. I'm instigating. <laughs> He's gonna. No, no. You know what? <laughs> Because my highest hit was in his balls. I'm going straight for the balls again. You're crawling down gonna, his bottom? Yeah, I'm going to get like a little beetle. I'm gonna Finger crawl down. tutting down his body. Nice. The balls. All right, one last big punch, I hope. Oh, this guy is like a tank. <laughs> okay, I got an 11 plus 4. That's 15. And then I get a roll again. Yeah. Oh, God. I got a 5 plus 4. That's 9. The 15's a hit. So. Oh, thank Jesus Christ. Oh, been close with my All right, 13s. time to roll no, two more dice. All right, hold on. Three. Please, God, get like an eight. Two. I got a five. So that's five. And as you strike that triumphant strike, how do you want to describe it? Because it's definitely what? a hit. You hit. I'm going to fucking like this, motherfucker. <laughs> hammer it down a flying with elbow room. down onto my balls yeah, as, as you hammer it down symbiote style it splinters and the suit <laughs> and hits his real balls fly, yeah. flies away your fist is definitely still well, burning into, into the yeah. real balls of, of yeah. you as the armor of chester slithers away it forms a quick pool and the strands start Making their way quickly into the towards the edge of the water. Oh, we should probably get. We should probably grab that. Yeah, chase they're, that they're thing down. Fast. Like burn it, dude. They're <laughs> moving fast. It's like mercury. What did it sound like when it like went away? It was like. Yeah. <laughs> All right, cool. Very similar, <laughs> actually. Ear, ear, ear. Uh, hey well, well, what was that all about? <laughs> yeah, Breen puts his shillelagh away, and I, I'm gonna say he's still there. I throw a harpoon into the heart of you. Uh, is it, guys? I just want to, like, I just want to apologize about like how I was acting with that. Uh, Whoa! Back on. to the uh, Are yeah. we gonna chase this thing, or it's just we're letting it go? Uh, I want him back. <laughs> <laughs> I miss him already. I know he did some okay. fucked up stuff, but I miss him already. I want him back. Yeah, look, you were Jerry's ears off. <laughs> yeah, my lobes, my lobes. You want me to talk louder so you can hear me? I said I want him back. <laughs> For those uh, that can't hear, I want him back. Um. So yeah. Chester has began swimming off into the lake. <laughs> okay, bye, Chester. Bye. Well, now we're going to have, like, a golem thing to worry about. Yeah, God yeah, damn it. Like, what, is, what is that? To be continued? I don't want that shit. Yeah, he's, yeah, I that. He's, so he's killed me. And I, I, I walk up to the edge of the lake, and I go, We will meet again, dear friend. We will become one soon again. Will you not talk like that after what was clearly, like, you should be happy that it's oh, off you? Back. Is is Hugh fucked up from that? I feel like he's got his balls. No, this is just hurt. my like okay. You know what? Tom Hanks. He probably was pissed off that he got stuck on that island and cast away. But there's that moment when he's on the raft and he's he's leaving. He looks back at the island and he goes, "I don't want to leave." You know, it's like a Stockholm syndrome. 
I was stuck inside sure. Chester, but Chester's I'm like... I'm curious if you have face. hair or balls. Yeah. <laughs> um, I, definitely balls have, okay. I definitely What's do have... I definitely do have, like, fryer hair now. Like, I, the top of my head is yeah. straight up bald. Yeah, you have to get some sort of punishment yeah. for what you've done. Uh, Hey, you know, okay. JB, who got it worse? You know, you ain't got no ears. The top of my hair is probably going to be like this for a couple weeks. Guys, we can talk battle scars all day, okay? We all got pretty beat up. <laughs> but the, the moral of the story is that we're together again, and we're all okay. Uh, that's what it's about. Survive that flip out of the trees. <laughs> yeah, earlier I got a pretty, and I show the hole in my mouth way back. If you really look, there's a tooth missing. Yeah. yeah. Actually, that might have been a wisdom tooth. That actually might have needed to come out. Okay. Um. Uh. It feels good to be well, myself again, though. Yeah. yeah, what's different about you now? Um, I my legs are free to move. I are can, you happier? Yeah, or are you gonna be a nice a jig? He's excited to be free. You'll, look at him. you'll be an overall happier, better person. Nicer, yeah. maybe thankful. I don't nice, look as thankful. Good. Maybe thankful for what we just did. Saved your life. No, that maybe. I'm not. I I repeatedly told you guys where would hurt. Chester and not hurt me, and you went out of. Your we can tell what was Chester and what was I you. Repeatedly no, said fair. my hands were actually. Well, were I mean, that's not a Chester trick. Uh, that's <laughs> How are we to know where your arms are? Yeah, man, you possessed, Why would they man? not be in the arm slots? <laughs> because like I pulled them in when the arms were. We were in the you arm didn't snatching. Say that out loud. Place. Yeah, you didn't. <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, These are my real <laughs> arms, and then I pull out my real arms and <laughs> sleeve. <laughs> That's why I missed all the time. These were but illusions. It just oh, kept my, falling. My, my real hands would have thrown that well. Okay. And we're all on the same track. Yeah. And you're all on the same track. And you're able to rest easily yet again. <laughs> oh, we go back to bed. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't think I'm sleeping out. Fuck yeah, that man. guy's still out there. Yeah. Is that until large? you're awoken by Breen, who says, Oh my God. <laughs> Dude, by the way, we should really thank that guy. He kind of like won yeah, that. I know, he deserves, so, yeah, he deserves some. Without props. Breen and his How, goddamn uh, like broomstick or whatever, we would be doomed. Yeah. 